Yes, I'm leaving. Anything the matter? What? Darling, I'm surprised you're asking me that question. Cut of the money I asked you for my shopping. I'll be going with my sister later today. Vera, why are you behaving like this? Why are you like this? Eh? I told you to forget about that thing. My container just arrived a few days back. And I don't have any money with me right now. I should forget about that. Yes. I am only asking for 150,000 Naira. Only! And you are here giving me excuses. 150,000 Naira is a huge amount of money. Okay, I am not saying I will not give you. I will give you. But give me small time to sort out things. It's a lie. Okay, let me ask you. Have you changed my wardrobe since you got married to me? No, answer! Have you? Vera. Vera. Why are you doing this? I know how much I've spent on you before we got married. And those things you bought will last you for long. Oh, Diego. Please. But it's true. Please, please. It's all good. Don't get me angry. Don't get me angry. Why are you living a miserable life? No, wait. Why are you living a miserable life? All the money you have. Eh? You, you, you won't leave this place until you give me that money. Do you realize I'm your husband and you're pushing me that way? I'm not pushing you. I'm just romancing you. Give me the money. I will see you when I come back, okay? As if you're not listening to me. I say you're not leaving until you give me the money. Why are you doing this? I need to shop and look good like my fellow young girls. Okay, I love the way you are. You're beautiful. You're doing it for me. I love the way you are. So I don't love the way I am. that way for me. Okay? I don't love the way I, I am. I love the way you are. I, you, I don't love it. I don't love You think I'm joking. See, give me the I, money. I, I, I don't like what you're doing now. Don't just like it. Hey, open that gate. Don't, 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 don't try it. Don't, don't, don't open that gate. Give me the money, please. If you try that, I'll punch you. Come and open that gate. Are you kidding me? Ah, kick you now. Don't get out. Give me the money. Ah, give me the money. Why are you behaving like this? Open the gate, my friend. If you open that gate, if you open that gate, no food for you. You're not challenging me. Give me the money. I'll carry on my head. Give me the money. Stop this now. Help! Cindy, what is it? Oh, you okay? You're asking me, huh? Why did you eat me? What did I do to you? Oh, don't talk to me like that! Can't you greet? Huh? Eh? You can't greet! <laughs> you know what, Yuki? I have noticed that you find it so difficult to greet. But let me remind you that this is my sister's house and I deserve every respect from you, okay? Take note of that, fool. Nonsense. in this house. Cindy, you slap me. What will you do? You get, I'm asking you, what will you do? Huh? Tell me what you will do. What is going on here? Sister, is it not this idiot you kept in this house as your maid? I asked her to boil water for me and she refused. Is that true, UK? Auntie, hush. I don't want to hear anything you have to say. Cindy is my sister and you will not disobey her in my house. Is that understood? Yes, ma'am. Now hurry with the water. But fast about it. See the Gary.
didn't go for shopping again. Says who? Nobody. I mean, you didn't care to show me the things you bought. Oh. So you know if I spent all the money you gave me, isn't it? Meaning what? Why are you talking like that? Don't I have the right to, to, to know the things you bought? Oh, now you're shouting. You're shouting at me because you gave me ordinary 150,000 naira. Huh? Wait. You called my hard-earned money ordinary? Huh? I don't blame you. Or oh, oh, other men give their wives one million, five million to, to go for shopping. Yeah, here shouting because he gave me ordinary one fifty thousand naira. Please, I don't want trouble this night. Please. very close to the stadium, sister. This boutique is the best in town. I wish you didn't shop last month. It doesn't matter. You will still take me there. Sister, you need it. You know what? I promised the man that I will be coming someday with my elder sister. <laughs> You're taking me there tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow. Okay, sister. Okay, sister. <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am. Yes, you can. What is it? I guess more than a sister are you. Where are they? In the living room. You can go. Yes. Sister, are you aware of their visits? No. Neither do my husband. Keeping her now. I thought the housemaid have gone to call her. No, maybe she's busy with some things. She'll soon come. Let her come out. Hey, I'm really tired. She'll come now. Hey! Hey! It's my husband that will wear that you will come. No, I didn't tell him. What's I tell him? This is my son's house. I don't have anything to say to you till he comes back. Excuse me. Mama, what's the meaning of this? I don't know. Why is she acting as if you are strangers? Maybe I'm hey. as shocked and confused as you are. I didn't expect to receive this kind of treatment from her. Huh. Well, when Buddha comes back, I'll tell him what just happened. Why must she treat us as if we're strangers? Why? For what now? No, are we going to go now? Or go where? We, we are sitting here. See, when Buddha comes back, I'll be the first one to say, to tell him this. Why would he, why would he be like this? Sister, 
Is it true? Yes. Where are they? I left them in the living room. So why are they here? I don't know. You know what? I don't have anything to say until my husband comes back. Um, but sister, are you sure your husband is not the one who invited them? No. He can't do such a thing. Go downstairs and take them to the visitor's room. I don't want to set my eyes on them by the time I get back. Okay, sister. <clears throat> Give us anything to eat. That means you have to wait for your brother to come back. Me too, I'm hungry. Talk to me. Don't mind her. There is something I'm supposed to buy for her. I didn't get it. So that's why she's angry. Is that what she's telling me? not talk about that, eh? Everyone. How are you? But I'm not fine. I'm hungry. I've not eaten anything since we got here. Well, is that true? We see you. Like, I've not eaten anything, even no water. Me too, I'm very hungry. But I didn't give us anything to eat. Uh, Okay, let me ask my house girl to prepare something for you people to eat. Okay? No. Never. <laughs> You're welcome. Hey, look what I'm going to do. Hey, look what I'm going to do. That's my girl. That's my girl. Hey. Is this how they live here? And this is what I'm trying to understand. That's what I'm I don't understand this one. That thing again. What is it? What is the problem? Huh? So you knew they were coming and you didn't bother to let me know. It escaped my mind. Really? Yes. It escaped your mind. That's what you're saying. Okay, I am sorry. I'm sorry for that. Because she's your mother. I wonder why she's always coming here. Every now and then. Why is she always coming here? Vera, you're talking about my mother here. And so? And so? This is my house, and there are things I will not tolerate here, okay? It's okay now, it's okay. Don't, don't touch me, please. Stay away from me.
time. A preparing food. For who? Oga asked me to prepare food for his mother and sister. Did you tell me? UK, did you tell me? Mm. <sighs> Are you mad? How many times have I told you to get my permission before you do anything in my house? I'm sorry, Ma. How many times? I don't remember, Ma. Get out. Get out! Ooh. Let me get your left legs in my kitchen again. the food I asked you to prepare for my mother and my sister. I'm talking to you, my friend. Mother, stop me. Madam did what? Yes. She said I didn't seek for her permission, so she chased me out of the kitchen. My wife did that? Yes, sir. Okay. I wanted to rush to any nearby fast food and get food for them. Be fast about that. Yeah? Be fast. I don't want words for you. That. Please, allow me to sleep, please. Vera, Vera, I need you. Hmm. You don't need me. Go to your mother. She's the one you need. Why are you talking like this? Stop it. Stop it, okay? You think I'm joking? Please respect yourself to avoid embarrassment. Please. Vera, Vera, I am sorry if I've offended you. Okay. If you said, okay. if, okay? There, I need you, I need you to stop this. Stop it. Stop it. You think I'm joking? Respect yourself. Maintain your space, please. was from a fast food. Why are you talking like that? When you were here yesterday, when uh, yeah, you told the house girl to go and prepare or something to eat. Why did you talk like that? Yeah, he did. Yeah. But his wife stopped the cook from preparing the food. What? Mm -hmm. How did you know this? <laughs> the house girl told me. That's serious. Because you they don't cook again in the house. No, no. Hmm. So what happened? Oh, <coughs> no. Brother, huh? good morning. Good morning. Are you ready to go to work? Yes, almost. Uh, almost, yes. Mama? Uh, oh. Please have this. Hello. 
I want you to use it for your transport back to the village. Did we tell you we are going back today? I know, I know. I, I just wanted to get your things ready. I wanted to go back to the village. Are you chasing us out of your house? I did not say that. Okay? Mama, please, don't misunderstand me. When next you want to come, get me informed before coming. When next I want to come to your house, I should get you informed before coming. Yes, Mama. That is permission now. Mama, you know I'm now a family man. Okay? You need to tell me before coming to my house. Don't just come. Oh, Mama, what? Huh? Brother, why are you sounding like this? Why? Are you, are you, are you deaf? You just heard my explanations now. And you're asking me. Yeah? Mama, please, do not be angry. Go. Just let me know when next you want to come. Just get me informed. Go. Go. Let's come over, my son. What is wrong with you? it was a joke until he came out again and started shouting on top of his voice huh? that we should leave that he wants to enjoy his peace in his marriage Look at his that. marriage life is more important than me his mother he on her is is he mad hey that's what i don't know i don't know what they have done to my son i don't know what they have given to my son I want Isok, don't marry that girl. I don't like her, neither do I like her family. They are evil. Yeah. They are very wicked and heartless of human beings. But his sister that married her, look at where it has landed everybody. Uh, oh, it, it is okay. Um, that he got married to Vera should not be why he should turn his back. Eh? Why he should abandon his own people. Get, get in here. Get in here. You don't understand this whole thing. I saw an aged From the way that boy spoke. It shows that he's under a spell. Or something more than a spell. Uh, uh, it's okay. Don't, uh, don't run into conclusion yet. Some men change their character. Immediately they got married. Huh? It's, uh, we've been seeing that. It's all it's not like that. Is it not my child that grew under me here? Under normal circumstances, that boy will not ask me to leave his house. Me, his mother, to leave his house. My only son. The one that has stood all these years as my husband. Who do I do? Uh, Who do I run to? Who do I turn to? Who do uh, I go to? Don't worry yet, huh? Um? Um, I will send a message across to him to come back. I need to look into this matter immediately. Yeah? Thank Don't you. cry yet. Don't cry. It will be all right. Thank hmm? you. It will be all right. Uh, let me let me run along now. Huh? Please, my dear, to your family. Mm -hmm. It will be okay. Hmm? Mm -hmm. I will look into the matter. What do I do? Exactly my point is what everybody says. You know, Binaka, everything will be alright here. Yeah, things are turning so badly. Where do I go? Who helps me out? Who is going to talk to him? Nobody is even understanding the point I'm coming from. Nobody wants to help me. Everybody will come and tell me everything will be alright. Yet I am dying. So what did I do? My son, what did I do to you? What did I do? She. Cindy and I will be shopping today. Where you shopped last month? I know, but Cindy discovered this new boutique in town. She said that the seller has the best stock from Turkey. Mm -hmm. Let me see. I have a building project I'm planning, so we don't need to be spending money unnecessarily. Are hmm? you saying the little money you give me for shopping? To stop your building projects. Uh, no, no, that is not what I mean. That is not what I said. I said 
we should manage the way we spend money unnecessarily. I mean, I gave you 150,000 naira last month to shop. I see. It's okay. I'll call my father to give me the money I need. You can keep your money. Ah, you tell him. See. Please. Please. Vera. Vera. Has he taken his breakfast? Yes, sister. He should go. I don't want to set my eyes on him this morning. He got me angry. Sister, how much did you tell him? He started complaining before I could say anything. Hey, my building project this, my building project that. He's just a stingy man. Um, Cindy. Please get the other phone, let me call him later. Okay, sister. Um, baby. You said you want to go for shopping. Hmm? Okay. Here. This is hundred thousand naira. What exactly am I going to buy with this change? You know what? Keep your money. Excuse me. Excuse me. I don't just need any disturbance this morning. I don't need it. <sighs> Hello? Brother, good morning. Uh, good morning. Uh, better, what is it? Can't you people allow me to rest for once? Eh? Brother, sorry for the disturbance. I actually called because of my jam registration fee. The deadline is next week. Uh, better, I don't have money to give to you now. Please. Brother, please. You really need money, please. Didn't you hear what I just said? Must you go to university? I said I don't have money to give to you now. Please, I'm busy now. I'm driving. Eh? I'll call you back later. Brother? Hello? Hello? understand why brother has decided to be treating us like strangers. But you needed to hear the way he shouted at me on the phone. 
He even said there's no monster will attend university. He's all said that to you. Yes, Mama. Do you know he's actually the one paying for Cindy's school fees? Why can't he do the same to his own sister? I don't understand what's going on. What is going on? What have they given to my son? What have they done to my child? What is this? What is this? Just, just calm down. Come, let's go inside. Help you. I need money for my job. No. The money you gave me for shopping wasn't enough. I'm owing 40,000 naira. I don't understand. What don't you understand? I said I'm owing the boutique owner 40,000 naira and I promised to give it to him tomorrow. Then how could you spend 350,000 naira just a space of one month on a wardrobe alone? I knew you were going to go there. Do you know how much my father gives me every month before you got married to me? Oh. Do you know? I know you said that. So that is what you always say. Vera, we are still on a project. We are building our home. Building our home, my foot! You never told me you were a gold digger when you came to marry me. Listen, don't get me upset. Please. husband's sister. What else is she calling for, if not to ask for money? These people are just nuisance. Hello, brother, good morning. Brother Bowa gone today. What do you want? Why can't you allow my husband to rest? Eh? Uh, listen, don't call this number again. Don't try it. In a book, we find a bonyala rubbish. Hey, every time. I heard you talking to someone. I wasn't talking to anyone. Did my sister call? I am talking to you. I don't know. Mother gave the phone to his wife. So he doesn't want to talk to his family again. He gave the phone to his wife. What? She warned me never to call him again. What did you just say? His dog. My own his dog. Gave his phone to his wife to respond to your call. 
think I should just let brother be. Let me forget about the jump issue. No. No. What did I do? What did I ever do wrong? What did I do to his own? What did I do to anybody? Why would that boy turn his back on me, his mother, and to his sister? What did we do wrong? What did I do wrong? What did I... How did I find this uncle? Stop crying. It's okay. It's not okay. <laughs> it's okay. Even if he has decided to abandon us, we're not going to die. Never. No. I never turned my back on him. I never let him down in any way. I never left him. I sent him through school. He went through school. I gave back to him as a free human being. His legs are working, his hands are working. I didn't do anything wrong to him. All what I did wrong was to give him back to him. And he can never turn his back on me. That I will not. Is that good? He will not turn his back on me because I didn't turn my back on my son. I didn't turn my back on him. I didn't turn my back on him. I didn't know my back on him. Why would I say that? I didn't know my back on you. I didn't know my back on you. I didn't know my back on you. like this. What happened to your face? This? Your color has changed. Everything about you has changed. Ah. It's obvious your husband is not taking care of you. I said it. No! Ah. He promised to take care of you. What is he doing? M Mom, look at me. Am I that bad? You mean you don't see yourself in the mirror? Oh no. I'm sure he's not back. Because his car is not here. Whenever he comes back, I'll talk to him. I'm really very upset now. What, sister? I told you. You ignored me. Thank God mom is here now. Okay. about her. She's not just useful. you go from the market to? What kind of question is that? Where do you think I went to? Oh, you're answering my question with question, right? You know what? Your days in this house are numbered. What do you mean by that? Oh, you want to know? Don't worry. When I'm done discussing with my sister, you will understand what I mean. Okay. She left this house for the market since morning and she's just coming back. 
Where did she say she went to? That was my question, and she started running her mouth. Is she mad? <laughs> is that how she behaves? That is because Sister Vera treats her with soft hand. That is why she messes up all the time. No. Ah, your sister has to watch that girl. She's leaving this house, so she must leave this house. Once I'm done discussing with my sister, I know that definitely she will leave. House. You needed to see the way she was running her mouth. Why is she taking long to answer me? Let me go for her. You okay? You okay? Are you really coming back from the market now? Yes, ma. There was riot and it really affected the activities in the market. So why didn't you explain like this to my sister when she asked you? She refused to listen to me. Ma, please. I don't like the way she talks to me in this house. Hey, shut up! Look at this one. Who asked you to speak? This is my sister we are talking about here. If you had behaved yourself, she won't talk to you in that manner. Now hurry up with the food. Lunch time is almost gone. Get out! Out! Stupid. Sister, you know what? She has to leave this house. Yes! Let's look for someone else. She must leave. One day. One day I will slap that girl in this house and face the consequences. Can you imagine? Mom, it's okay. You have made your point. Does he know the fortune it cost us to raise you? Or is it because we allowed him to marry you? Huh? I know all that, mother, but... But what? Eh? But what? You mean? My in law. Who is your in law? Mom. Don't mom me. What is it? Eh? Darling, what is going on? Stop calling her that because you don't know the meaning. Look at my one time beautiful daughter that we allowed you marry. You just go. Look at her. Her color has changed. But I've been taking care of her. No, you're not. My very beautiful daughter that we allowed you to marry. Look at her. Her color has changed. You promised us that you would take good care of her. But look at her. Look at her color. Well, Vera, you will go and pack your things. Because anything can happen. I don't understand. Very soon you will understand. <sighs> Darling, what is going on? Please. You keep disgracing me in front of my people. Thanks. That's what she gives, no happiness, only sadness, I'm fallenness, every day, wickedness, selfishness, and happiness, it's what she gives. Vera, I'm not happy. I am not happy the way your mother used to embarrass me each time she comes here. 
My mother never embarrassed you. She was only telling you the truth. What truth is that? You know what? I'm not ready for your drama this night. Or I will go out and tell her. Hmm? As if I care. Oh, you don't care? If I were you, I would go and plead with her. Because she's serious about going home with me. feverish as soon as you left in the morning. Is that why you should be seated on that side? Yes, because I'm feeling very cold. No, Mama, you shouldn't be here. Let's go inside, oh. No, 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 no allow me to stay here. I'm very cold. Mama, you can... catch a little sun more. Mama, you can't be here. Let's Aye. go inside. I'll go get some drugs for you. Aye. Please. Aye. Aye. No, please, let's go Aye. inside. Please. spend some weeks with my daughter and her husband. I couldn't stay there anymore. Why? The moment I stepped my feet into that place, I got very angry. In whatever, very to go. If you see her skin, she has changed color. I even wanted to, 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 to bring her home, but she started begging me. Wow. Izog is not taking good care of her. Like I said, I wanted to bring her with me. But she begged me and I had to let go. Izog promised to take good care of my daughter. He has failed. He has failed us. Woefully. Anyway, never mind. I'll call him on phone and I'll talk to him. Uh -huh, Chief. Warn him. Warn him not to play with my daughter. I told you that my sister will be going back to school tomorrow. She needs 80,000 uh, to get her handouts. Handout again? I thought I've given her money for the handout. Well, the money you give couldn't buy all. What's going on now? What a pick your call. I really need to tell him that my mother is sick. Please speak up. Pick, pick, pick. Oh, I don't need this disturbance this morning. Hey, baby, what is it? Why are you calling me this early morning? What is it? Brother. <sighs> Good. Brother, please speak your call. Pick. You say, Beryl, again, what is it? Hello? Brother? Brother, good morning. A very morning. Why do you keep disturbing me? Eh? What can I do for you? What is it? Brother, please. See, Mama is seriously sick. She's sick. 
Well, you see, I am very busy now. Hmm? I'll call you back. I will call you back. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Who do this now, brother? I'm telling my mind, you are here hanging up on me. Am I going to run away because of you people? Eh? What is it? So what are you saying? Ask your sister to send her account number or transfer the money to her account. I don't have cash with me now. What about her pocket money? Yes, are you planning to let her go just like that? Didn't you hear what I said? I said I don't have cash with me here. Very well then. I'll give her the 50,000 that asked me to keep for the landlord. <clears throat> Why is Vera treating me this way? Why? Does she think I have other source of income apart from my business, that one business that she knows? What is this? What is this, God? Good. Oh. Uncle, good morning. Hey, what is the problem? Where are you hurrying to? Uncle, my mother is dying. Please help me take her to the hospital. Please. What is the problem? Uncle, she took it two days ago and all the drugs I gave to her from the chemist man could not yield any results. Please. Uh -huh. uh, but, but have you called your brother his work? Uncle, please. Uncle, I don't understand brother anymore. I've been trying to reach him since morning. Uh -huh. Please, let's take her okay, to the Okay, let's hospital. go and see what... Why is he coming? Eh? Why can't these people allow my husband a, a, a moment of peace? These people are really getting on my nerves, honestly. I know what I'm going to do. Let me delete his number so that my husband will not know that he missed his calls. Nobody called you. You care for some fruits? No, no, no. Yeah. Okay. Mm. That reminds me. Cindy called. Oh. Mm. She's grateful for the money you sent to her. Okay. Thank God. I hope she's fine. Yes, yeah, she's fine. You sure you don't want? Good. Okay. What's the meaning of that statement? The meaning of it is that since 
yesterday we have been calling you alive. You don't want to be to tell you that your mother is sick in the hospital. You don't want to be to. And when you saw the the, the missed call, you refused to respond. You should have called back. If anything happens to your mother, I will tell her people that you killed her. Oh yes! Idiot. Oh, what did he say? Uh, forget about what, what he said. <sighs> um, let me go now and run around for money. Eh? Because I, I don't understand him. Eh, but keep this. Keep this 4,000. Mm -hmm. You might have need of it. If there's anything they need, you buy. Eh? Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much, Uncle. Mm. Thank eh, you. Eh, tell her that I will come back in the afternoon to know how she is faring. Okay. All right. So you are dressed and ready to go after the man insulted and called you names. Vera, it's okay. No, it's not okay. Don't tell me that. He should have told you what the problem was. Rather than giving you the type of insult he gave you over the phone. And you're here telling me that it's okay. It's not okay. Anyway, I am going to see my mother. Why won't you? She's all you care about. You think I don't know? Why are you sounding this way? Zoga, I'm not a fool. You see all this your pretense. There, I love you. I care about you. Upe, you don't love me. Your mother is the only one you care about. Vera, stop it. Just stop it. Please. Go. Go be with your mother. I don't care. Go. Wickedness, selfishness, heartless. That's what she gives. No. She's very fine. She's responding to treatment already. Oh, thank God. She was even happy when I told her about the money you gave to us. All right. Um, has the doctor come for a check? -up? Yes, yes. He said they run another test on Mama. So I deposited three thousand from the four thousand you gave to me. Oh, yes. That's good. Um. Well, I am, I am rushing to somewhere. In fact, to my house. Some people came to my house. Yeah? Yeah. And I told them to give me some minutes. I'm coming back. Okay. Yeah. All these fifteen thousand. Mm -hmm. hey, Anything they need, you use it. Yeah. Cool. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you very much. God bless you, family. Thank uh, you. Um, let me go and meet them. I will come back in the evening. No problem. Sir. They know how she is very. Good day. Ah, Nico, all your greetings. I don't need it. You hear me? Um, remember to tell your mother that in the evening I will come and check her. Eh? Okay. Hello. Thank you very much. Yes. What can I do for you? I want to beg you for something. I'm listening. 
I need some money, like two thousand. What for? My unders, they've worn out. I want to replace them. Are you out of your mind? Don't I pay you for your services in this house? I'm sorry, Ma, but Ma, you've not paid me for three months now. Shut your stupid mouth. If you hear you say that again, I am going to slap you. Now get out. Get out! So where is he now? He left for the village to be with his mother. You shouldn't have allowed him to go to the village. <laughs> I should have forced him. So is his mother really sick? Says who? She's not sick. Uh -huh. She just wants to lure him. Mm. They're only interested in my husband's money. That's all. Can you just imagine that? My dear, you have to take it easy. You have to take it easy and you have to be careful. I hate those people. Why wouldn't they allow me to enjoy my marriage? Eh? Why? I don't, I don't just even understand. They will not let you be, be, be at peace with your husband. They will not let you enjoy your house. What is all this? Eh? What is all this? But my darling, calm your nerves. Cool down. Calm down. They never wanted him to marry me. Huh. Yes. My dear, the more I talk about this, the more I boil in anger. Calm down. The more I boil. Calm, calm down. Let me get you something to drink. Oh, oh, but make it soft, okay? All right. Vera, Vera, it's not all about getting married earlier than your friends. It's all about keeping the marriage. <laughs> oh. I don't like stressing you. I hope I'm not stressing you. No, not at all. <laughs> I know you didn't prepare food for you. Oh, really? Yeah. Hmm. You will not finish me. This is your beautiful house. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. Vera, are you really sure that your husband really loves you? If he actually loves you, he will not go to the village and meet his mother. Have you thought about it? Well, think about it now. Wisdom, wisdom, wisdom. Uh -huh. See, you are right. Of course. <laughs> Lucy is always right. Listen, a man will leave his parents' house and be joined onto with his wife. <laughs> I mean, both of them will become one flesh. Ephesians 5.31 is written in the Bible. It's there right there in the Bible. You need to understand what I am saying. Think. Think. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I heard you. What I think you should do is um, you should really check if the mother is sick. So that you actually understand what I am saying. I understand you perfectly. Uh -huh. I don't need a private investigator to know that the woman is not sick. Uh -huh. She's not sick. <laughs> That's oh. okay. Um, are you actually traveling to see your parents? Yes. At least let him miss me for some days. Let him stay for some time without me. I want him to miss me. It's, it's the right thing to do. It's the right thing to do. Yes. It's okay, my friend. You need to calm down. You need to take it easy. I was actually going to ask you. You look so beautiful. What is your beauty regimen? I, I really want to know. <laughs> like this? With all this stress? Look at you! Please, Big me. man wife! <laughs> <laughs> they won't allow me to enjoy the marriage. Can That's the problem. These people should just allow you to enjoy your home. Eh? What is all this? What is all this, eh? I don't understand. I should allow you to enjoy your home. It's your home.
going back to the city immediately. Ah, you're going back immediately? Yes. Why now? My wife has been at home alone since yesterday. And some of my customers have been calling me, so I need to go and see them. Won't you tell Mama before you leave? No. Help me tell her. This is about the... Uh, Ten thousand naira. Hmm? Just take care of mom. Brother, this money won't be enough for us now. We have nothing left in the house. And mama is now on diet due to her diabetic condition. I better have nothing left with me here. Okay, manage that ten thousand naira for now. But what about the money Uncle spent at the hospital? I'm stupid. I just told you I have nothing left with me. What I have here is money I will use to buy fuel when I'm going back. Did I ask Uncle to take mama to the hospital? Okay? Don't get me angry before I take that money back from you. What is the problem? Hmm? Go back to your mother. You claim to love me, but you don't. Have I wronged you in any way? Please, let me be. And you see, I was called because there was an emergency. Then I went to the village. I came back. You never cared to ask me how I went. What if it was your mother? Here you go again. Always making reference to my people. Why must you do that? Like I said before, let me be. You know what? You can have this thing to yourself. Wickedness, selfishness, happiness, that's what she gives. No happiness, only sadness and fallenness. Every day, wickedness, selfishness, and happiness is what she gives. By the time I asked after him, Mm. Everybody said he had already left for the city without even telling me. Oh, well. You mean his dog left this village without telling you? I said, that is the truth. Hey. He didn't tell me. What is wrong with this boy? What is wrong with his dog? Eh? I said, that is not even my problem. Whether he tells me or not does not bother me. But my problem, the one that is paining me, is the money you spent in the hospital before he came. He couldn't even drop it for you to have back your money. He gave a better party, 10,000 naira, said that was the only thing left on him. Oh, well. Huh. But since then, has he called? Hmm. Huh. One John Cabo That's not called. Does it bother about me anymore? Oh, oh. Ah, well. It's okay. Let that not bother you. Hmm? Um, if a belly comes back from the market, they had to come to my house. My wife will give her two heads of plantain she caught this morning. Hmm? Thank, Thank you. What could I have done without you? Hmm. 
Thank you very much. Uh, let me be going now. Huh? Uh. But don't forget, tell a bell to come along. Yeah? Uh. Thank you all. Oh. I Is she home? No, she's not. She went to see her people. She traveled? Yeah. Without telling me her bestie? No, 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 no. She's, that's rude. That's really rude. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, thank you. Can I sit down? Uh, please, forgive me. That's okay. Please sit. That's okay. Um, <clears throat> can I have a glass of water? Okay. Just a minute. Okay, take your time. <sighs> Water that I really like, low temperature. Okay. Low temperature. Right? Okay. Yeah. yeah. You're good, huh? Oh. Mm. Um, Isogo. I actually came to see you. You came to see me? Uh huh. Um, I really like you. No, in fact, I am in love with you. Your wife, she doesn't. What exactly are you trying to say? What I am trying to tell you is that your wife actually married you because of your material things, your landed properties, your cars, your houses. I mean, because you are a rich man. Look, I'm not saying you should divorce your wife. I wouldn't, I wouldn't tell you to do that, but... Look, just... I actually want to be that special friend. That friend that would be there when you want her. That would comfort you. <laughs> Get out of my house now. <gasps> Look, if you want me to leave my house now. I can strip if you want me to strip. Strip I'll... and leave. I should strip and leave. Strip and get out. I want you to understand. Leave my house now. I'm craving for you. I want you to leave my house now. <gasps> out. Reminds me, I've not called my friend Lucy for some time now. Okay, let me call her. Hello? Hey girl, what's up? <laughs> How are you? I'm fine, my darling. How are your people? They are fine. <laughs> Where are you? 
what I'm, are you still doing here? I'm in my house. Uh, Vera, when are you coming back? I don't know yet. I'm not ready to come back to that beast that calls himself my husband. Uh, come on now. Your husband is one who needs you. Needs me? Oh no. He needs his mother. Ah, oh, my dear friend, uh, uh, Iswago loves you so much. He needs you. Ah, uh, sweetheart, I just called to know how you're doing, okay? Take care of yourself. You did well, my darling. I'll speak to you some other time. All right, bye. Bye, friendship. And what's the meaning of that? What's the meaning of what? You heard for yourself, your wife doesn't love you. I mean, I'm, I'm here giving myself to you. Wanting you to accept me, wanting you to take me, like, take me. Leave my house and never come back again. <laughs> Don't worry, I am coming back for you. I will come back for you. I will come back for you. Wickedness, selfishness, happiness. That's what she gives. No happiness, only sadness and fallenness. Every day, wickedness, selfishness, and happiness. It's what she gives, no happiness, only bitterness, unfollowness, every day. What I am trying to tell you is that your wife actually married you because of your material things, your landed properties, your cars, your houses, I mean, because you're a rich man. I don't know, I don't yet. know yet. I'm not ready, I'm not to, ready come to come back to that, to that beast, beast that, that calls, calls himself, himself my husband. husband. I don't know, I don't know yet. yet. I'm not ready, I'm not ready to come back to that beast, beast that, that calls himself, himself my husband. How did you get in here? The door was open. How are you? Good, I'm fine. So right now my wife is not yet back, so we can start going. I am aware your wife is not back, but I am here to see you. I mean to be with you, spend some time with you. You're here to see me? Yeah. You'll see you in the same. You're my wife's friend, for God's sake. Look, it is high time you stopped, okay? Your wife doesn't love you, but you see me, I care about you. I love you so much. I know. But I love her that way. Don't you understand? I want you. I, I, I just want to be... I'm a married man. I don't care. I am good with my wife. Listen, this is an opportunity f to prove to you that I want you, that I want to be with you, that I, I just... Enough of this. Enough. You can use the door now. Can you just listen to me at least? Let me... I need you to understand what Just I'm... use the door now. Come on, go on. 
Well, I don't care if he rejects me. But I will never stop. Go on, use the door now. I will never give up. Have that in mind. What are you doing in my house? I, 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 I actually came to see if you returned. Really? Yes, really. You are supposed to call me first. Ah, uh, uh, I called you severally, but your number, your numbers were not going through. The two phones were not going through. I, I just came and your husband told me that you, you, you haven't returned. I have to leave immediately. Are you doubting me? Whatever. You're supposed to hear from me first before coming to my house. My friend, I am sorry. You know I care about you so much. I wanted to check up on you. I'm so sorry. You can check my phone. I've been... I... Aha! Yes, um, how was your journey, my darling? You have not told me what my friend was doing here in my absence. Talk to me! What do you want me to say? Or rather, what do you want to hear from me? You said you met her outside. So why didn't you ask her what she was doing? I did, but she lied to me. I knew it and she, she, she observed it. How could you? How could you invite her to our house in my absence? Vera, stop it. Please, just stop it. I don't like it. I didn't invite her. I did not. She said she came to look for you as she told you. Fine. No problem. The truth will come out one day. But if you think you can cheat on me and get away with it, then you have another thing coming. You know I cannot cheat on you. You know it. You know you don't. Don't. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Be fast. I, I'm, I'm rushing to somewhere. There's something I would like to tell you. I need some money to replace my one at home days. Meaning what? The month just ended three days ago. And I, uh, you, 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 you're, you're talking to me about uh, money. Have you not been paid? No, sir. I've not been paying for three months now. What? You've not been paid for three months? Yes, sir. Are you telling me the truth? Yes, sir. How much do you want? Two thousand yeah. Thank you, sir. Thank you. I'll just make sure I give her her salary every month end. Until now, she's not been paid. I wonder what she's doing with that money. I will find out when I come back. Meet 
wickedness, selfishness, happiness. That's what she gives. No happiness, only sadness and fallenness. Every day, wickedness, selfishness, and happiness. It's what she gives. No happiness, only bitterness and fallenness. Every day, heaven knows I try to make it work, but it seems she never cared for me. Happiness is now a history. Tears and sorrow is what she gave to me. Heaven knows. You are not supposed to ask me. I'm supposed to ask you because I've been giving you a salary all this while. It is none of your business if I be her or not. She is my maid. And this doesn't call for quarrel. Because I've just asked three questions. You shouldn't have. I see. It has gotten to the extent when my maid reports to you, my husband. She didn't report to me. I told you how it started. I see you have money to throw around. Did you seek my opinion before giving her the money for her underwears? You've not told me why you are keeping her three months' salary. You've not told me. And I will not tell you. Since you have money to throw around, no problem. Go on. Be giving her money for her underwear, okay? I am yet to find out what is going on between you two. I'm watching you. I will find out. Keep throwing money with me. You've not told me why you're keeping her money up to three months. You still tell me. So you had the nerves to report me to my husband. I don't understand, ma. You don't understand. Come here. Ah! Who do you take me for? A fool? It's not true anything, ma. I will slap you again if you say that rubbish. You reported me to my husband. You told him that I have not paid your salary for three months. Am I right? <laughs> that is not how it happens, ma. I only ask him money for my underwears. Look, Uzibana. You had the effrontery to ask my husband money for your underwear. That's seduction. Oh, you want to seduce my husband? No. With your dry behind? Eh? Look at this idiot. You see that your salary? Say bye bye to it because I will never pay. Tell my husband I said so. You will never get that salary. Now get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Look, look, look at this dry bone. Okay, you want to collect my husband from me? Asking him money for your underwear. Idiot. Come and take the salary. Let me see.
What? When? How? Oh my God, no, 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 no. Oh. Hmm. Can you imagine? He didn't even have the courtesy to tell his wife where he was going to. One, uh, take it easy. It's not the end of the road for you. When there is life, there is hope. This is not the end of the road for you. Hmm? You conquer this one. Okay, B, where do I start from? Where do I go from here? Everything I've worked for, all vanished in thin air. All. I understand how you feel, my lovely brother. But you see, the only thing that doesn't have remedy in this life is death. And you are alive. That means there is hope. Ikobe, I'm finished. I'm finished. Yeah, you're not finished, my brother. You're not finished. Don't worry, listen. One day, on the other day, you'll be fine. One car, you get married, you'll be fine. Don't let it weigh you down. Hmm? Don't let it weigh you down. Get into the car, let's leave here. Hey, Paul, let's go. Listen, it's more challenge. Yeah? It's just more challenge. You'll be fine. See, when you have life, there is hope. I'm your best friend. I'm always there for you, okay? Don't worry. You'll be fine. Dude, you'll be fine. Get into the car. Let's go, okay? You'll be fine. Taking my calls. He has started again. He has started again. What is it? Let's go inside and talk. No! Well, the truth is, there was a fire outbreak at the market yesterday night. Including your husband's shops were burnt. I don't understand. Wait, wait. You, you... Everything? Nothing was left? Nothing was left. Everything got burned by the fire. Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> Come on, it's okay. Even it's the money fire. he hid in the shop, everything burns down. Everything got burned by the fire. <sighs> Come on, listen. It's not the end of the world, okay? Everything will be fine. Right? Just take it easy. You'll be fine. Everything. Ah, 
my darling friend, how are you? How are you? I heard what happened to your husband. I'm really sorry. Why are you looking at me like that? You're not talking. Sorry for what exactly? For what happened? Oh, if you should be sorry for anything, it should be for dating my husband. Oh, you think I don't know? Dating? How would you say? Clean your mouth. Why would you say that kind of thing? Are me? you dating my husband or not, Lucy? Vera, why will you even ask me such a question? How will I be dating your husband, my friend's husband, my best friend's husband? Yes, because you have not explained to me what you are doing in my house in my absence. Ah, my friend, you are my... I wonder what you even you want me to say. I, I'm... The truth, Lucy. What truth? Look, stop it, okay? You are my friend, I will not do that to you. You have to believe me. Why are you doubting me? Tell me the truth. There's nothing to tell. Excuse me. You... What truth? I don't understand. I heard the young man lost his shops. Yes, Dad. Just three days ago, his containers arrived. He spent all he had on them. I don't know what we're going to do. You see? You see? I told him it is not good to put all his eggs in one basket. Exactly. Yes. I advised him to start up a business for you, but he refused. Huh? Mom, I don't know what to do. I don't know how we're going to survive in that house. Our house is going to expire next month. Ah. Hey, <laughs> hey. I wonder why that young man lacks initiative. Chief, I think it is better for you to invite him over and talk some sense into him. Because our daughter will not suffer in his house. Yes, Dad, please. Invite him over. I will not suffer in that house. I will not. Well. My dear, don't worry. He will invite him over, okay? Meanwhile, let's go to the kitchen so that I'll give you something to eat. Oh, I like the sound of that. <laughs> we'll be right back. All right. Uncle, that is how all I labored for disappeared into thin air. As I'm talking to you right now, I have nothing left with me. To be honest, I'm not happy with you. Okay, let us not go into all that, please. You abandoned your sister and your mother. You are back now, here, because you have a problem. Tell me, what reason do you have to abandon your people? Tell me, your wife and your in-laws are the only people you care about. Is that no wickedness? No, answer me. Is that no wickedness? Uncle, I just told you that I lost my shops and every of my goods in them. And this is all you have to tell me. Would you have visited if not for this tragedy? You did not share your good times with your people. With your family. Now you want to come and share your, 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 your sorrow. That is not fair. It is not fair. Uncle, it's okay. Let's forgive him. Uh, well, uh, it's not that um, I am happy over what happened. But let him accept his faults. And learn his lessons. Uncle, I've heard. I've heard all you said. But please help me beg Mama. She's still very angry with me. Please. My friend, please help me. Please. Please, I'm in a big mess now. I need this money. That piece of land is 50 million. I can sell it less than that. Okay, how much do you want to buy it? 10? 10 million? What you're talking? 
No, 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 no. Ten million is too small, and you know it. So why are you talking like this now? It's okay. I will. I will get back to you tomorrow. Okay. You can. What is it? Say what you want to say, please. I want to go out. Please, I need money to send to Mexico. She has been bothering me for some time now. Were you not paid your monthly salary? I was paid. I just need more for the payments. Please. You came to my husband for what? Darling. Hey! Excuse me. So after all my warnings to you the last time, you still have the nerves, the effrontery to approach my husband for assistance. Please remember, I, I don't know how to tell you about it. Oh, you didn't know how to tell me about it. But you know how to tell my husband about it. Hi, hey! UK, enough is enough. I can see that you have started developing hot pants for my husband. Hmm? Vera. Yeah, eh. Vera. Eh, Venom. Allow me, please. You think I'm a fool? You think you can fool me? You think I don't know your moves in this house? Eh? I am watching you. Both of you. I'll ask you. As for you, I'll ah. fuck you. Like electricity, my daughter. I will suck your blood. Oh, that is why you're always coming to me. And I want to buy a new bra. I want to buy new pants so that you'll be sampling them for my husband. Vera. Okay? Vera. Eh? Vera. Let me tell you. Before you cross this side again, you got that test. I will shock you. I will shock you. You think you can collect my husband from you? Ifeka, you are too small. Hey! Okay. Arrange yourself. What do you want to arrange? What do you have? What did you come with in this house? You see this uniform you are wearing? I've used it to settle you. Mom, please, I beg you. Mom, sorry. I don't want to get house with you. Mom, you know my condition. Mom, get out of my house. Get out! Mom, please. Please. Okay, man. Take it back. Take, take her out of this house. Push her out of my house. No, 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 What are you doing? Come on, get out of this place. I'm sorry. 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 How are you? Good, sir. Pass it down. Where is my daughter? She's fine, sir. Go ahead and tell me why you are here. Okay, Chief. Um, Chief, please, I, I need your help. Like right now, I have nothing doing at all. And my wife is about to put to bed. I have nothing with me. 
Please, I need your help. I will pay you back. <laughs> Isog, you know I'm a retiree and I'm sitting all day at home doing nothing. So, how do you want me to help you? Okay, uh, Chief, um, please, could you help me talk to your son, Obina, who is in abroad? <laughs> Maybe he can send me some money. I, I am going to pay him back. You want me to talk to my son, Obina, to give you some money? So I can start all over again. It's what we feel me. I'm ashamed of you. Look, 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 look at the, the, the kind of lazy bones that identified himself as my in-law. Chief, Chief, why are you talking like this? You're embarrassing me. I should embarrass you the more. You're supposed to be doing something to help yourself. And now you're here telling me you need some money. Look, 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 look. I want you to feel embarrassed so that you can wake up from your slumber. That your shop's got bond is not an excuse for you to go cap in hand, begging for money. Chief, thank you, sir. I have to take my leave now. You are working out on me? Come on, will you sit down? I'm telling you something that will be useful for you in your life and you are working out on me. Sorry, now let me warn you. I don't want my daughter to go hungry in your house. Because if you do, you see the best of me. Livinius, you're a madman. <laughs> Don't you know that I'm a married woman? Yes, I am married. Really? Want to take me out on a date? Hmm. Please count me out. Don't count me. <laughs> I'll call you back. I'll call you back. Who are you talking about? It's none of your business. I asked you for money. You didn't give me. But Oboru UK, you will give her. Vera, stop that rubbish. Just stop it. I should stop what rubbish? Anyway, for your information, I've sent her out of my house. What? You did what? You heard me. I sent UK, your lover, out of my house. Darling, what is wrong with you? Why are you behaving like this? Why? Please give me the 80,000 naira I requested for, for my new week. I should give you 80,000 mm -hmm. When I'm still running around to see how to gather some money to go back to my business. And you're here asking me for 80,000 naira for your weaver. You don't have conscience at all. You don't just have conscience. Vera, I will not do it. You will do it. Mamia. Yes. Hey, so because I'm a married woman, I should be looking haggard. Hmm? No! I will look sexy, I will look beautiful like my fellow young girls. You want to go? Hmm? Not be one my wife. You will finish what you started. What is it? Listen, if you don't have money, go and borrow. Failure to do that. This house will not contain both of us. Go and borrow! Go and borrow! See what is coming out of your mouth. Go and borrow if you don't have or it's your car and give me the money. Just see what is coming out from your mouth. What is wrong? What is wrong with you? Wickedness, selfishness, heartless. That's what she gives. 
no happiness. Only sad. Are you planning to sell the land at the express? Zorgo, I am talking to you. Yes, I'm planning to sell it so I can add the money to my business. Why were you hiding it from me? What's the meaning of that question? You wanted to sell the land without my knowledge. What kind of a person are you, Zorgo? You asked if I want to sell the land. I said yes. Is there anything wrong with that? Yes! Everything is wrong with that. I am your wife. If I didn't ask you, would you have told me? I'm supposed to know everything that is going on in your life. Have I wronged you in any way? Oh, please, spare me that rubbish. Rubbish? Me, talking rubbish. Okay, let me ask you. Since I lost my shops, have you ever asked me how I've been faring or how I've been feeding in this house? Why will I ask such stupid question? And I'm a poor. Are you not the man of the house? Vera, change your attitude. It's bad. Why are you treating me this way? I am your husband. Hey, ho. Husband, my left nose. Uh, meanwhile, you've not told me why you chased you gave me. Why are you bothered about her? Am I? Yes, you are. That's why you keep asking about her. Am I not supposed to know what is happening or what is going on in my home? Well, if you must know. I chased her out because I don't want you to get her pregnant. Vera. Vera what? Eh? Vera what? Ukonaga wangwa. Ananaga va va. Afuya. You got go? I know all your moves in this house. Vera watched the kind of statement you used before me. Let me tell you, Zog. I will never be afraid to tell you the truth. Hmm? Huh? I started suspecting you the very day you started giving her money. Mm. Yes. Wait. Are you insinuating that I'm sleeping with her? You know better. Hey. Ma, I quite girl school. You know better. You know. Hello? Yes, what is it? Ah uh ah. -uh. Take it easy now. Calm down. Are we quarreling? What can I do for you? Why are you calling me? Um can, can, can we can we talk? Can I have a date with you? Please. Listen, let me tell you something, eh? Stop calling me on the phone. Don't ever call me again. Do you understand? I don't want to, I don't want to see your, your call on this phone again. Just leave me, just let me be. Stop calling me. I will not want you again. Who was that? I, look, I, I, I just want us to... Hello? Hello? Ah! Somebody. Person does not have any. 
you will hurt my baby. Lucy. So you are still seeing Lucy? Lucy, Vera. No, don't call my name. My parents will hear this. Listen, just listen to me, okay? You don't have anything to explain to me. I can explain. You cannot explain anything. Just listen. My parents will hear this. Wait, just listen to me. I'm pregnant. Let me explain. You have the baby. Let me explain to you. And I've realized it. I told you to let me go. You've injured me. Oh, shit. Serves you right. Excuse me. Vera. Vera. Hello, husband snatcher. You think I will allow you to break my marriage? Vera, please leave my house. You should be ashamed of yourself. No wonder you always talk ill of my husband. Vera, make use of the door. And if I don't? Hmm? Your plan was to bias my mind and take over my marriage. You should be ashamed of yourself, you shameless shame goat. Vera, I will not have you insult me in my house. Insult you, you said? Are you not shameless? Are you not a husband snatcher? Answer me, you ship! You wanted to slap me. You are not afraid. Try it! I'll like a biscuit, idiot. Get out of my house. Now you listen and listen very good. You will not like my action the next time you call my husband on the phone. Shameless she goat. Get out of my house. Shameless she goat. Please leave my house now. Leave my house. Take a look at this. What is it? Check it. What? 130,000 Naira? Only. <laughs> I just need this uh, 130,000 Naira to buy the first set of baby stays. I'll come back for more money for the second set. <laughs> Vera, you know, this is too much. You know, I just got back to my business. It's too much. How is that my business? You have to give me the money. You just sold your land recently. Are you saying that you cannot squeeze out 130,000 naira to give me for shopping? Your baby's shopping. So because I sold land, no one wants to squander the money just like that. Squander the money because I demanded for ordinary 130,000 naira. Come on. Vera, please try and understand. No, 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 no. There's nothing to understand here. You will give me that money. House. This house will not contain both of us. What is it? Don't you have him and sit back? Look at the condition you put me into. Anytime I ask you for money, you will still be doing like this, doing what I don't know. Vera, Why are you such down. a stingy man? Calm down. Hey, don't tell me to calm down. You will give me that money. You will give it to me. Huh? has come over her.
Hey, I think that's it. I came to see you. Sorry for keeping you waiting. Hope all is well. No, there's no problem at all. Okay. I came concerning what I told you the last time you came to my uncle's place. Remind me, I forgot to. I want to go and walk. How about your school? I remember you told me you're praying to write them. And I think stay idle now. I need to learn a handwork. It's alright. Um, well, I collected 5,000 to put in my work, but you can bring 20,000. 20,000 Naira? I you it. That money is too big for me now, you know. You know we don't have that kind of money. Please, let me give you 15,000 euro, please. Me? There is nothing I can do. I already removed 5,000 from you. That's why I said she bring 20,000. But please, just because of me, let me give you 15,000. Even the 15,000 euro, I I will still have to run around to look for the money. We don't have that kind of money, please. It's still because of you I removed 5,000. Just get to the stars. back already. What happened? What happened? What is it? Mm -hmm. She said I'll have to pay first. So how much is she asking for? Twenty thousand What? That is too much. Where are we going to get that kind of money from? I asked her if she could take 15,000 naira from me. 15 what? That is too much. That is on the high side too. You know we're barely feeding this house. Where are we going to get that money from? No, I'm tired of staying. I do. I need to start up something. I know. But that money is too much. I don't have it. Where will I get it from? Maybe I should go ask Uncle if he could lend me the money. Then when I start up my own, I will give him back. Is it not too much? Food here, money again for expenses here. Is it not too much? Oh, I don't know what else to do. I don't know what else to do. Come, let's go inside. Please help me. Help me, please. Ebele, you came in at the wrong time. I made some expenses this week that left me with nothing in my account. Uncle, please. Please, I beg you. I have nowhere else to go to. Please. Please, Uncle. Even if I can raise 15,000 Naira, I'll go and beg at Tingozi. Please. Excuse me. Okay, I'll for you here. This is five thousand naira. Hmm? Hold this one first. 
Thank you very much. I will talk to Ngozi hmm? to accept 15,000 naira from you. Huh? Okay. Thank you, Uncle. Thank you very much. Let me stop with you. Thank you. Isuk is the cause of all this now. Why don't he care for his mother and sister? What is wrong with this? It's about that work issue. Don't worry yourself. Mama, you will not understand. All my friends are in the university. I'm still at home doing nothing. Like I told you earlier, stop worrying yourself. Everything is going to be alright. I've made up my mind to go visit Brother Iso. He should give me the money, else he will cease to be my brother. Enough is enough, Mama. I have Eberi. kept quiet for so long. Eberi. Two wrongs will never make a right. Take it easy, your brother. I believe he will come around soon. For how long will brother continue to treat us like this? For how long, Mama? It's only when he has a problem he will know he has a mother and a sister. Mama. I've kept quiet for so long. No, we should stop deceiving himself. So he came back with such an amount of money and he has been complaining there is no money. Now he is here counting the money so that I will not see it. Hmm. It's all gone. Still awake? Yes, I'm still awake. I thought you'd slept. What are you doing? I'm doing some calculation. I see. Calculate very well. It's okay. I'll join you soon. Ah, no, my dear. <laughs> you don't need to bother yourself. Take your time and calculate very well. Okay? You can even sleep here, no problem. Anything? 
I asked you to give me money for, I mean, to complete the baby things I couldn't buy in the market the other day. What about the 130,000 uh, I gave to you? 130,000? Yes. Ha! That's a forgotten issue. How? Baby things are very expensive in the market. So I couldn't buy the baby's bed. So I just, I don't need much this time. Just 50,000 naira. Vera, you are very extravagant. Eh? You are so extravagant. Extravagant. No, no, come again. Extravagant. Extravagant. I'm extravagant because I asked you to give me ordinary 50,000 naira to buy your, your own baby's thing, so. Eh? Why are you always disgracing yourself in this house? Each time I ask you for little, little money like this. Why? Do you know what? I don't have money to give to you now. I will not do it. You're a big liar. A siocha. Mm. Yes! You think I didn't see you last night? I saw you counting huge amount of money. If it was Bomia. But I already seen you. Yes, I saw you. So give me the money. So every night you'll be meandering to see who is counting money. Give me the money. What is it? You know I'm pregnant. I don't have strength to do this. Or that's what you want to hurt our baby. Give me the money. Then respect yourself. Stop this. Give me the money, baby. Can I pass, please? You know you're pregnant. Can I pass? Huh? Excuse me. Give me the... Please. You know I'm pregnant. Do you want to hurt our baby? Give me the money. That money you were counting. Got that 50 or 100,000. Give me. I, I, just. I. You. I. Oh, the baby. The baby. Sorry, the baby. What? The baby. Then respect yourself. Give me the money. Respect yourself. Give me the money. Even the baby yeah. needs the money. Eh? Give me the money. It's okay. When I come back. Eh, eh. No. Oh. You. 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 Yes, before I knew it, he pushed me and walked away. Yes, because I asked of 50,000 Naira only, only oh. Yes, mom, he has money. He came back with huge amount of money yesterday. Mom, I have not even bought my baby's things, bed and other things. I've not even bought them. Really? Don't worry, I'll tell your father. Okay, Mom. All right. Take care of yourself. Okay. Zog, I will sit here and wait for him. Let him go and come back. I heard you talking to someone. Vera just called me. I hope she's alright. She told me that Isogo has refused to give her money for shopping for herself and the baby. Why? That he doesn't have money. Moreover, that um, Vera is extravagant. Extravagant? My daughter, okay. extravagant? Mm. How dare he make such a derogatory statement against my daughter? Okay. Call him. Mm -hmm. Call him and warn him. Make it clear to him that Vera will not give birth in a cheap hospital. It has been one problem after another since this young man married my daughter. I'll, 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 I'll call him. So you reported me to your parents that did not give you 50,000 naira, but you failed to tell them that I have already given you, you that I know, 130k, 130,000 naira. Is that why you're worried? Why? Why? 
Why are you treating me like this? Does it mean you don't just care about me? Do you care about me? I'm asking you. Do you care about me? You're just pretending. You only care about your mother and your sister. They're the ones you care about. Why are you talking like this? Why are you talking like this? I've been taking care of you and your family. Now tell me, what have I done for my family? For my people since I married you? Say it. No, go ahead and say it. That is all you see all the time. What have your people done for me since you married me? Tell me. You know what? You're just an ingrate. Eh? I blame myself. I don't blame you. You're the one that is an ingrate. You should be happy you got married to somebody like me. Fear again. Fear again. Where are you going to? Come back here and exchange words with me. Useless stingy man. Your meat buy cars. Or go for their for their wives. But you umba. Ordinary 50,000 naira, 200,000 naira. Chin, come chin. You cannot give to me. Useless, shameless, stingy man. Idiot. Things are getting worse every day. My wife's extravagant spending is seriously affecting my capital. Her mother threatened that I must take her to the Kingsway Hospital for her delivery. Kingsway Hospital is the costliest hospital in this town. Now my goods in the shops are almost finished and my bank account are my bank account almost empty.
What is it? Why is your face like that? She came and took the food I was eating. Who? Your wife. Why? Where is she? Is she back home? Yes. 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 I am back. Why did you take away the food that Bella was eating? Why is she eating my food in my house? I don't understand. By the, what is she doing here? She has every right to be here because she's my sister. And this is my house. I don't need her here. Let her leave. Vera, why are you so wicked to my people? Why? Wicked? <laughs> I've not seen anything yet. This is just the beginning. Let her go! Go and get her food. What? Go and get that food here. Hmm. Instead of me to give her that food, I'll throw it to the dogs or put it inside waste bin. Why are you being so wicked? Why? Let her go. This is my house. I don't need her here. Let her go. Oh, shh. Come on, eat him. What's really happened? Imagine the way she snatched the food from me. I wonder what you must have done to your wife. It's okay, just disregard whatever she did. Okay, I'll talk to her. What about my food? I'm very hungry. See, I don't want Mama to hear about this, okay? About your food. I'm going to give you money. You go down and check any fast food and get something for yourself to eat. I should get food outside yeah, go when go. there is food in the house, brother. Go get something for yourself, okay? Just do what I ask you to do and don't argue with me. Selfishness, happiness, that's what she gives. No happiness, only sadness. Do not allow your husband take you to any other hospital apart from King's Wings. Did you hear me? I've heard you, Mom, but I doubt if he will listen to me. I wish you would come around and pressurize him. As soon as you feel the first signs of labor, as I told you, do not hesitate to alert me. Okay? Well, then as for his sister, Nobody knows her mission then. Be watchful. Be very careful. Hmm? I heard you. Don't mind your husband. Take good care of yourself. Um, <laughs> I have to be on my way now. And, mm. um, you will deliver like the evil. <laughs> Thank you, Mom. Amen. Amen. <laughs> so, my regards to Father when he comes back. He will hear. Okay, take good care of yourself, okay? I will. All right, my dear. Mm. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Isog, I will not allow you to joke with my daughter's life. So this is the new style. My husband has been getting you food from the fast food since you came here. Auntie, what is it now? I will give you a dirty slap if you ask me that stupid question again. Look at you. Do you know how much it costs him to buy you food every day from the fast food? Oh, I see. You are here to squander his money. That's not true. You are still talking. Hmm? You are still talking. Dude. Let my husband come back. Not to work. Till he comes back. Dude. 
if I ask him for money now, he will tell me, I don't have money. But he will have the one to be buying you fast food. Okay, we'll just collect this thing now. For the last time, my berry, did you enter my kitchen? Yes. What for? I was looking for a knife. So you entered my kitchen. Don't try it again. I don't want to see you this inch close to my kitchen again before you poison my food. Idiot. That reminds me. If you are waiting for my husband to give you money, you will wait and you will get old. If you know what is good for you, pack your rags and go back to the village. Go back to the village. Do you hear me? It's you. They are eating fast food. Rubbish. Pack your things and go back to the village. Yo. Now, get your smelling self out of my living room. Get out! Auntie, I'm going nowhere. This is my brother's house. What did you just say to me? I'll pretend I didn't hear that. For the last time, I bury. Get your stupid smelling self out of my living room. Now! I said I will not leave. <laughs> How dare you? Have you gone nuts? How dare you challenge me in my house? How dare you challenge me in my house? How dare you? Can you imagine this, 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 this idiot, this smelling thin, challenging me in my own house? Fool. Eberi, what happened? I was, brother, I was watching the movie when she came out and off the television. Then she asked me to get out. I told her we not, and she slapped me. Vera. Hey, 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 please. Okay. Okay, question and answer. Eh? Age mates. Please. Vera, I will not take this from you. Else what? What will you do? Beat me because of this idiot. Go ahead. Try it. You're really pushing me. If I push you, what will you do? You're really pushing me so hard. What will you do if I push you? Beat me now. Beat me. Go ahead and beat me. even talk to his wife. She will never go free from this. Yes, mom. I'm not feeling anything again. Yes. I will notify you as soon as uh, it starts again. Hmm. His sister is still here. Oh. Hmm. 
He has been buying food from fast food since she came here. Okay, mom. I've heard you. Take care of yourself. Bye. Hey. My baby. <laughs> My baby will soon arrive. <laughs> hey, well. Almost an hour he was called. Up to now he is not yet back. Now I know how he has been maltreating my daughter. Anyway, thank God I'm here. He will come and meet me. Okay. This is when you're coming back. Where is she? Where is who? Eh? My... Almost an hour. That we called you to come and take her to the hospital. Look at where, where you're coming. I, uh, anyway, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Why are you telling me you're sorry? Am I the one that is going to the hospital? Uh, okay, let me keep. Where are you going now? I want to keep this sense inside. Who can give me this thing? You don't have any sense of urgency. Useless man. Hey! Who the matter did you Her mother was on my neck because her daughter's labor lasted. She was shouting and screaming, telling everybody that I want to use her daughter for money ritual. Your mother-in-law said mm. that? She nearly attacked me, if not for the intervention of the nurses and the doctor. Hey. Why? What? What is wrong with that woman? Why is your mother-in-law behaving like this? I don't know. I don't know. My wife was later booked for cesarean oppression. What? You mean she went for CS operation at Kingsway Hospital? Yes. Who advised you to take your wife there? Who told you to take her there? Her mother insisted we must go there. And she was there when I made the first payment of 200,000 naira. Now tell me, Odogu, how much did you spend at last? <laughs> My brother, I finally spent 332,000. 300 what? And 32,000 before my wife was discharged from the hospital. As I'm talking to you now, Ikobi, I have nothing left in my house. Oh my God. Oh my brother, I feel your pain, okay? What about your sister? She went back to the village. She cannot stay with them. Oh wow, okay. Um, you know what? Let's drive to my house. I have something very important I want to discuss with you. You got like it, yeah. You like it. Let's go. What kind of a man is this wrong? A man who cannot take care of his family. He went to the market since morning and up till now. He is not yet back. Hey! Yeah. Mom. Does it mean that my husband is not yet back? <laughs> I've not seen him. He's all gone. Izogo has started again. Are you sure he really went to the market? Because I saw the way he left here. My problem now is that I'm very hungry. Very, very hungry. Maybe you will go and drink tea again while we wait for him. Izogo is stepping on my toes. He is stepping on my toes. More tea in the morning. I'll drink tea in the afternoon. Tea, tea at night. My mumbo one na tea. He's stepping on my toes. Oh, 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 oh,
I will wait for him here until he comes back. I can't drink any tea again. Mama, I was shocked when Buddha told me how much he spent at the hospital. Hey! That Vera has killed my son. I don't know if she wants to render him useless. What wrong did he do by marrying her? Mama, it's brother that brought everything upon himself. He refused to listen to you. Mm -mm. Don't see it like that. He's your only brother. Eh? He's my only son. It is that his wife. Everything is on her. She's responsible for everything happening around here. Mama, my only happiness is that brother finally gave me the 20,000 naira I asked for. Before that very day. If not, hmm, you know your son now. Even one naira, I wouldn't have seen anything from him. God. Hmm. Bless my son. Help him. Help him. Oh, Mama, let me go there. Why? Why do I have this thing happening to my son? Why will he be going through this just in, 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 in the name of marriage? What? Sorry, I've not been here since the last time I came. I've not been around. Okay, this one you're here. My uncle told me you've accepted to take 15,000 euro. That's true. Yes. Thank you. I came with the money. Okay. Take this for your transportation. I know you're coming from a very far place. So, thank you very much. Thank you. God bless you. Okay. Thank you. Are you starting immediately? Yes. Okay. Come inside. Okay. <laughs> so, what wrong have I done to you? What is it? Oh, you still have the mouth to ask me what it is. Eh? I will not allow my daughter to die here of hunger. It's not possible. What have I done? The question should have been, what have you not done? How much did you give your wife this money? I gave her money to go to the market and buy whatever she wants to buy. 10,000 Naira. And you're proud of it. In echo. Uh -huh. eh? Is 10,000 Naira not enough for her to buy whatever she wants to buy in the market? What can 10,000 Naira buy in the market these days? Eh? You should be ashamed of yourself. Shame on you. Huh? I will not allow my daughter and her child to die of malnutrition in this house. It's not possible. Mama, it's wrong for you to dictate for me how to run my home. It's wrong. I don't blame you. I blame myself for even giving you my precious daughter to marry. I don't blame you at all. Your daughter is the reason I am broke today. Ngiwa, <laughs> you are just a lazy man. You are just looking for who to who to blame. Stop looking for anyone to blame. It's a it. You are lazy. On a, which brain box going to be? Itty! 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 Itty!
Stop blaming my daughter. Vera does not have a hand in your poverty. Nonsense. You're just lazy. It's lazy. What does this woman want? Eh? You want me dead? Eh? Plus you, plus your daughter. Every day, wickedness, selfishness, and happiness is what she gives. No happiness, only bitterness, unfollowness. Every day, heaven knows I try to make it work, but it seems she never cared for me. Happiness is. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go inside. Uh, we're home. Uh, where exactly is this place? Uh, come on. I told you we were going to my house. This is my house. Vera, Vera, with my mother and my younger sister, Derry. It's okay, come on, let's go inside. Inside where? Please. House. I thought you have a big house. I don't like this place. I'm irritated with the environment already. Vera, why are you embarrassing me in front of my people? Embarrassing you because I said the truth? I don't like this place. I feel irritated. Please take me out of here. It's okay. I I I am sorry. Okay. Come on, let's go inside. Come on. Please, stop. please stop it. Please take me out, please. Vera, you're embarrassing me. I don't care. You know where I'm coming from. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Come See on, my please. father's house, right? No. Please, please, please take please, me out please. of here. Take me out of here. Where is that girl from? Mercy from Amogu village. And her parents? Mm, her parents are still alive. And they are good people. Hmm. That girl has bad attitude and cannot make a good one. Mama, forget what you saw out there. She's a good person. She's not always like that. <laughs> it's all. What I saw in that girl out there is bigger than this house put together. Therefore, you will not marry her and cannot marry her. Mama, I love her and she loves me too. It's okay, put love aside and face reality. Open your eyes to the truth of the situation. A bad wife is an instrument of destruction. Mama. And the death trap to her husband. Mama. Mama, she's a good person and she will make a good wife. Brother, she said I should call you. Ah. Yeah, she's ready okay, now. tell her I'm coming, eh? She said you should come immediately, else she will leave you and go. Hey! Look at it. We just spoke about her and it's happening already. Hey! Fire. So. What is this still doing there? Izogu! Izogu! 
Ni zangu. Why are you standing here? Take me out of here, please. What is it? What is the problem? Huh? Take me out of here. Now. See, Mama is complaining about you already. It's like I care. I don't care. Let her complain. Anyway, it's okay. Hmm? By the way, why is she complaining? What did I do? I said it's okay. Can we go inside now? Do you know what? Mama prepared a delicious meal for us. A delicious meal? Yes. And this rat hole? Oh, please. Vera, Vera, stop it. Please. This is my house. Take me out of here. This place irritates me already. Take me out, please. Please. You know where I'm coming from. Take me out of here. It's okay, come on, let's go inside. We will leave first thing tomorrow morning. Are you joking? Like I'm going to pass the night here? Oh, please. Take me out. You know what? You can take me to the city. Come back and be with them. Problem solved. For now, take me out. Mm. Yes, so. uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't have cola, but I hope you manage this. Hmm? I've, I've told you not to bother yourself. Hmm? <laughs> How can you come to my house without taking anything? I'm going to go to one sip, Thank you, thank you so much. Yes. Mm. Uh, you are welcome. welcome. Um, your mother told me that you came home the other time with a very beautiful lady you intend to marry. Yes, of course, that's true. But, you know, I couldn't just get here before we went back. Mm. And another one is that we've already fixed a date for our traditional marriage. It's you You've done what? Okla fixed a date. Ah, it's you How can you do such a thing? When your mother said, you will not marry that young lady. She, she told me everything about that lady. And I shared the same view with her. Huh? Uncle, there is no going back on that. I've done all the necessary arrangements with her parents. You've done the arrangement with her parents without involving your own people. And they move to him, eh? Uncle, let's not just go there, please. Izuog. Don't be in a hurry to marry that young lady. Just go home. Back at Eh? Our people said, Opa no Okoburu. Ntichirie. That's what she gives, no happiness, only sadness. I'm falling next every day. Wickedness, selfishness, and happiness. It's what she gives. No happiness, only bitterness. I'm falling next every day. Heaven knows I try to make it work, but it seems she never cared for me. Happiness is now a history. Tears and sorrow is what she gives to me. Heaven knows I try. Who are you? Who are you? Leave him! Leave him! Wait, see. 
Go and put it. Come back and carry this one. What? 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 Vera, what is going on? Go and bring baby. Eh? Baby. Go and bring baby. Baby to where? Eh? Don't mind him. Who's baby? Yeah. Mama, tell Mama. What is it? I am going to push you down. Push me now. If you don't sleep in the cell today, Mate, you know it's not. Eh? Um, Try it. Mama, don't block. Okay. You know. What do I do? Chief, she has not been picking my calls for three days now. I don't know what I've done to her. He's wrong. Yes, Chief. Are you kidding me? I'm not kidding. You do not know the reason my wife brought Vera and the baby to my house? Chief, I have no idea and that is why I'm here to find out. My wife told me you hardly feed my daughter and the baby, two of us. Chief, the thing is that things are hard for me these days. I don't, I, I don't even go to market anymore. The, the goods in my shop are finished and Vera is aware of that. Vera is aware of what? My husband, what is this fool doing in my house? Good day, Sit down first and hear what he has to say. He doesn't have anything to say. Now get out of my house. Eh? What is eh? What is eh? You want me to push you out? Respect yourself and get out! I don't ever want to see you there again. He said he has nothing left in his shop. Mm -hmm. How is that my business? He is a man. Let him face his responsibilities. I don't even know how we got to this point. I'm extremely disappointed at his work. I never knew it would come this way. I'm not playing. I'm serious about it. I don't even know how we allowed him allowed him to marry our daughter. My daughter, allow me come with Punochi Mangole. Let me be happy for my God and with my God. Let me appreciate him for his faithfulness. Who am I that God is remembering me? Eh? Thinking for me. Look at what he provided for me. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Hey! Look at it. Full bag of rice. One carton of noodles. See oil. Hey! Look at it. Look at it. One full bag. It's not the one you tell me, Mama, I'm not full. Oh. Cook more. Oh. Bring more. Oh. What do we buy? Oh? You must be taking this one, one cup, two, two cups, this one and that one. Now we have a full bag. Can eat it as anything. Thank you. Hey! Come on, 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 one bag of rice. All for me, Felicia. All for me. Eh? For Felicia. Did the Zog come back? Which is Zog? He's talking about which Zog now. See the man. <laughs> it is a belly. Huh? A belly bought everything. A belly bought all these food items for you. Yes! Hey. Yes, so please help me thank her. Uh, let me dance with hey. you. 
For in this life, you will not look for it too long. God will just give it to you. Yeah. He said, Good husband. He said, Hi. Hi. Thank Wonderful. You. Please. Please. Yes. 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 you can stand and enjoy. Uh, hey. Eh? Hey, you must more rice, you see. Why not? <laughs> you were back off it. It could be I'm confused and I'm tired. I don't know what to do. There is nothing left in my shop. I cannot believe it, my brother. I just can't believe it. Do you know that my wife and her mother are the cause of my problems? I don't know if they ever want any good thing coming out from me. Don't worry about that. Okay, you'll be fine. Hmm? You'll be alright. Don't just let that bother you. It could be how. How? Oh, it's over three months now my wife left here for her father's house and she never bothered to come back. She wanting about women. It's normal with them, but trust me when I tell you your wife will come back to you someday. She will have a repentant heart and she will crawl running back to you. Because I love Vera so much. I love her I know with you all my heart. But what I don't understand is why she's treating me this way. Is it a crime to love? No. Not a crime to love, my brother. Love is a beautiful thing. Then, why is my own different? Why? Listen, bro. In where we are. Don't allow things like this bother you. You'll be fine. Hmm? Just be a man. Don't go okay. Papaya. In where are. Stick it cheap, everything will be fine. Call me my mother. Or I be mad. I don't understand. See, my wife will crawl back to you. Just let her be. She'll come back to you. I'll give me life. She'll come back to you. Chief. You sent for me. Yes. See that I want us to talk. I hope all is well. It's about our daughter Vera. I think it's time she went back to her husband's house. Why? I thought we agreed she would stay here for some time. Yes. But after giving it a consideration, thought it is better she is in her husband's house. She's better off there. Which husband? Listen. This is three months and some days she has been here with us and she can continue like that. Chief, it is better she stays here with us than going back there and dying of hunger. You know me. I will never allow that to happen. I'll give her some money. But she has to go. People have started talking. Let them talk. No matter what you do, people must surely talk. So, let them talk. Vera and her baby are very important to me. Very precious to me. Same with me. Oh, But she has to go. Considering my image and personality. She has to go. If I don't like this your decision, I don't like it at all. There's no two ways to it. She has to leave. I mean, um, call Vera for me. Mom, did you see who came here this morning? No, I did not. Who was that? 
Father's friend, Mr. Oko. Oh, I know him. He was there three days ago. <sighs> yes. Daddy is not always happy each time Mr. Oko visits us. Because he always wants to know why Vera is still in this house. I don't understand. <sighs> he wants to know why Vera has not gone back to her husband's house. Uh, is he sick in the head? Eh? I don't understand why people should not mind their business. What concerns him inside that one now? Eh? <sighs> no. Anyway, your father wants to see Vera. Same issue. I told you that he's not happy. Oh. Your father also wants her to go back to her husband's house. But let her come back first. What kind of miserable life is this? Everywhere I've been to for help, you did nothing. I can't secure a loan from the bank because of collateral. I have sold everything I have. The man that wanted to give me keke on higher purchase gave me a very high price. Mm. She come back or what? Well. And I believe you slept with us. No, I couldn't. The thought of your brother flooded my heart all night. I had him in my mind. I was so restless, I couldn't sleep. I am so worried about him. I have told you several times to stop bothering yourself over him. Hmm? He will come back anytime he chooses to. He is my son. He is my child. Please do me a favor. Woman. Use that your phone and call him so that we can know how he is doing. Brother is doing fine wherever he is. You just have to relax yourself. Yeah, but I'm not asking for too much. Just call him on the phone so that I can hear his voice. Is that too much to ask? Okay. I've heard all you said. I'll call him. Hmm? If that will make you happy. Hey, but for now, Mama, I don't have any time. I'll call him when I recharge. Hey, but stop now. Just call him on the phone. Mama, you have to trust me now. You don't trust me again. I'll call him, oh? Just relax. When I recharge my phone later, I'll call him. Hmm? You have to shoot for me. I've not said that's my hair. Thank you. Hey. Hey! Every time my mother will be bothering herself over someone who doesn't even care if she exists or not. Oh, huh? I'm not calling anybody. Oh.
Hmm. He came you supposed to call me this morning. I wonder why he has not called. Get this food from? From the kitchen, of course. From the kitchen? Yes. From the kitchen? You entered my kitchen. I'm not Don't eating. try it again. I'm not eating this morning. And so? Give me that food, please. I'm hungry. Please. Hungry kill you there. You see that hunger? It will kill you. You are very, very stupid. For your mind now, you think I'll just prepare fried rice and chicken for you? Eh? Go to the fast food and buy food. Enano? Unya Adele. Vera. Eh? Vera. Hmm? I should not finish it. Hmm? If I get in my kitchen again, it's a regular poison. Vera, 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 bring that food here. My baby. Honestly, you are the sweetest thing that's ever happened to me. Oh. <gasps> Come on, Livinius. Stop mm -hmm. flattering me. Flatter you. <laughs> <laughs> are you serious now? You can see it. You know I'm telling the truth. Huh? <laughs> All right. Thank you. Now you're talking. <laughs> now you are talking. Mm? You know what? Um, I'm really missing you. So... When am I seeing this beautiful face again? I don't know. But you know what? Mm -hmm. We can always talk on the phone. That's true. That's true. Okay. No problem. No problem. Um, just a minute. Okay. My V. This is Oh. Keep it. <laughs> Anything for you. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. You're welcome. Um, yeah. So, yes, I should. No, I'll be on my way. I'll pick a taxi. You don't need to drop me. Are you sure about that? Yes, I'm very sure. Don't bother yourself, okay? No problem. <laughs> Just give me a call, okay? I will. <laughs> Take care of yourself. You too. Bye. <laughs> Damn it. She is one hot chick. Wickedness, selfishness, happiness, that's what she gives. No happiness, only sadness, no problems. Every day, wickedness, selfishness. Mommy will be back, okay? Mommy will be back. Mm. Okay? It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Where has Vera gone to? Eh? She will never tell me where she's going to. This. Where have you been? Uh, I went out. Sorry, baby. Mommy is here. You've not answered my question. I said, where have you been? And I said I went out. Do you want to start another quarrel this afternoon? Excuse me. It's okay, baby. <laughs> this is the third time you're going out without telling me where you're going to. Vera. Vera. Selfishness, happiness, that's what she gives. No happiness, only sadness. I'm following her. My house rent is another big challenge I'm facing now. 
Vera told me that the landlord was here yesterday. How I wish the man will understand my predicament. Have you seen the barrister? No. Why? I will see him. I will go and see him. Well, he's here to see you. What? Where is he? He's outside. Uh, um, um, okay, please tell him that I'm not around. Why are you laughing? You want me to lie? Because you're running away from your responsibility. Huh? Go and see him. Because I already told him that you're around. If you like, I told him you're around. You told him? Yes. Why now? Why? Why not? Why would you do a thing like that? Why not? Why are you running away from your responsibility? Come out and see him. Why is he wasting my time? I thought the wife said he's inside. Marissa, you're welcome. And you're here. I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry that I did not uh, come as I promised. I was trying to run around for some money, to, to uh, at least to gather some money and come and see you. Listen, listen. I am tired of your long stories. Exactly. I am sick and tired of your troubles. I have just come here to tell you to pack out of my client's apartment with immediate effect. Marissa, uh, are you going to eject me from this house just like that? How else do you want me to eject you? No, tell me. Barista, please, just give me a little time, okay? Just give me a little time to get this money. I'll come and pay up. I don't need a dime anymore from you. We don't need a dime from you. Just pack out. Look, look, let me tell you, if after one week you are still here, I'm sorry you will face court actions. Is that clear? Do I make myself clear? So, uh, let me... Where is the barrister? He's gone. Okay, so what did he say? He said he should pack out from this house with immediate effect. <laughs> or we face court action. Well, you have to pay him. Yes, pay. Because I'm not ready to leave this house. I'm not going anywhere. Vera, there is no money. Borrow. Go and borrow. What is your problem? What kind of a man are you? Are you not ashamed of yourself? Please. Do not insult me. I will insult you again and again until you do the need for. Stop disgracing yourself. I'm not ready to leave here. Go and pay. I don't blame you. I don't blame you at all. Is anything the matter? No, just that. I have not heard from my son. Neither have I seen him. And I better refuse to call him. I begged and begged she refused to call him. Hey, what happened to him? No, nothing happened to him. Uh. Just that I have not heard from him in a long while. Neither have I seen him. Just, I, I, I'm worried. I need to hear from him and know how he's doing, whether he's well or not. Uh, 
Uh, Mama is work. Uh -huh. Do not worry. Yeah. I, you know, his work is here, so. Uh -huh. But he does not care for you. No, don't talk. He like does not that. care about you. No, I said, don't say anything like that. It does not matter at this point whether he cares or not. I mean, mother. Eh? He's my son. He's my only son. I should worry about him. I've not heard from him in a very long while now. And nobody's trying to understand. That's why I'm begging the bailiff to help me call him. He refused. Uh, uh, don't worry. Eh? Don't worry yourself. Eh? I will call him for you. Oh. Hmm? Oh. Um, and that will be uh, when I come back. You know, I'm rushing to somewhere. No, no. Eh? It's a handset. Now you have it in your pocket. Why don't you call him immediately? I did not charge my phone. That okay. is part of it. Uh, when I rush to that place I'm going, uh, maybe I will charge it there. Okay. Uh, when I come back, uh, 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 will you come? Come later in the day. No problem. I will come. Oh, huh? let our sister come back early. Okay. Oh, so that I can we can talk and talk well. Oh, okay. mm -hmm. oh. Oh. Why are you staring at me like that? You are so, so beautiful. Like, you are so beautiful. I just can't take my eyes off you. Thank you. Every day you keep killing me with beauty of yours. <laughs> you are so funny. <laughs> No, let me do it this time. Mm -hmm. Come on, come on. <laughs> oh, stop. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Eat up, eat up, okay? wrong with her? She just developed this attitude of leaving the house without telling me where she's going to. What has come over her? Why is uncle calling me now? Eh? I don't just need this disturbance at all. I don't need it. He's ringing. But he's not picking. Eh? Maybe he's not where, uh, close to where his phone is. Hmm? Call him again, please. Call him again. Any disturbance at all. The phone 
is still ringing, but he's not picking. You see, I have this feeling that he, he doesn't want to answer the phone. I said, why are you talking like this? Huh? Is he fighting with you? Uh, uh, no, call uh, him again. Call I, him. I will call him. I will call him. Ah, don't I, talk like that now. I will call him. Two times now, he doesn't want to uh, pick. Yeah. Switched off. What? He switched off his phone. Has it, why are you talking like that? It was ringing a while ago. Now he switched off. He switched it off before me. This is a confirmation. Something is definitely wrong with his work. All is not well with that boy. But no. Now it has been confirmed. Hey, uh, what is wrong with him? Uh, Felicia. Um, I will advise you to go home and relax. There is nothing wrong with your son, his work. Mm. He is well wherever he is. I don't believe you. Eh? Everything you've been saying is right. But if for this one you just said now, it's not right. I doubt it. Something is definitely wrong with his work. And that thing that is wrong, I'm going to find out what it is. I will. Mm -mm. I will. His work. If I may. No. I'm I don't know what is wrong with your son. He doesn't want to pick phone. He switched it off. Well, maybe he knows. He knows why. Stop it! I don't want! Vera! Vera, I am talking to you. And you heard what I said! You have no right to leave this house without telling me where you're going to. Oh, please. I have every right to go wherever I like. Not in this house. What is wrong with you? No! Nothing is wrong with me. Rather, you are the one that something is wrong with. You are sick upstairs. Vera, I've had enough from you. What will you do? Beat me up. Go ahead! Try it! Beat me if you can! Before I do that, I will complain to your parents. Then. Will beat you mercilessly. You complain to my parents, he said. <laughs> I laugh in Chinese language. Look at this one. Hmm? You think my parents are happy that I'm here? Go ahead. Look at the road. Go and complain to them. Shameless, stingy, good for nothing man. Rubbish. I'll bring up for you, give one one as that's what you're good at. I've had enough of this rubbish. I have to investigate where she always goes to whenever she leaves this house. I think I've had enough. Jacoby, please, please, I need your help. Pico, I need to settle my landlord. I need some money from you. Please. It's horrible. You know you're my very good friend. I know, I know. My hands are pretty tight at I speak. Things are very bad for me. Things are pretty out of shape. There's no money. I will pay you back. I will pay you back. Listen, I'm not saying you're not going to pay me. I know you will pay me. You're my very good friend. But as it stands, there is no money. Money, you got the law. It's okay. It's okay. Let me start going. It's okay. He's all great, eh? One day will be tracking in the Mexican and a bazi war. It's not a war. But still, I don't have to like nine bad pass. But no, just keep everything. This is ten thousand. Just manage it, bro. Yeah. Please, eh? Don't pay back. Thank you so much. At least this one can buy my baby milk. Thank God. Thank you so much. I appreciate. Appreciate you. Thank you. I really appreciate. All right, okay. Thank you. Um, it's all good. There is something I've been wanting to tell you. Okay, what is it? So my conscience will kill me if I don't tell you. You know you're my best friend. Talk to me, what is it? I think your darling wife is cheating on you. Vera. Yes, Vera is cheating on you, I think so. Listen, there is this young man I've been seeing now with all the time. I think they are doing me fair okay, wait, wait, wait. You mean Vera is seeing another man? I'm not sure yet. Do you know what? 
don't tell her anything or ask her anything yet until we are pretty sure about it, okay? Um. Okay, okay. Yes, I told you I was not going to waste time. That's good. So how is my daughter? Hmm. She's very fine. If you see her now, you'll be so proud of her. She has changed. That's good news. Uh, did you meet the husband? No, he was not at home. And um, I was so happy I didn't meet him. I hope she is not the one feeding him. Trust Vera. She is now dealing with him the way I want it. Mm. Thank you. Welcome. Yeah. Let's go in. I did something special for you. Ah, I can't wait. <laughs> ah. I think your darling wife is cheating on you. Vera, there's a very cheating on you, I think so. Listen, there is this young man I've been seeing now all the time. I think they are doing me fair about that way. You mean Vera is seeing another man? I'm not sure yet. Do you know what? Don't tell her anything or ask her anything yet until we are pretty sure about it, okay? So, I need you to take care of the baby. I want to take my bath. Vera. Yeah. Yes, what is it? Who is the guy that you've been seeing? What kind of useless question is that? I have it in my notice that you've been seeing a particular guy. Who is he? Listen, I will not take it from you. One more accusation, I will put it to my father. Excuse me. Heaven knows I try to make it work, but it seems she never cared for me. Happiness is now a history. Tears and sorrow is washing it me. Heaven knows I try to make it work. But it seems she never cared for me. Happiness is now a history. Tears and sorrow is what she gives me. Wickedness, selfishness, heartless. That's what she gives. No happiness, only sadness and fallenness. Every day, wickedness, selfishness. And Who could have given? How did he know about him? Who could have given him such information? It's someone spying on me? Who could have given him such information?
You called me. Sit. It's almost three days to the landlord's deadline. How is that my concern? I thought you called me here to tell me that you have gotten a new place. I've decided we relocate to the village. Huh? No, 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 no. Come again. I said we are relocating to the village. You are who? A mama? Listen, Mr. Man, I am not going to the village with you. I will not! Baby, see, we are not staying there forever. We'll still come back to the city. Once things get better. I don't care! I will not go to the village with you. <laughs> Look at this man, oh. How do you expect me to go? If it's a joke, just stop it, please. Stop it. I said I will not go to the village with you. Don't allow my parents to hear this. Once things get better, we'll come back to the city. He is senseless, Mom. Why are you quarreling with him? Uh -uh. Is it not that useless is all that calls himself my, my, my daughter's husband? What has he done? Vera called me and said that um, Isog is planning on relocating them to the village. What? Why? That he could no longer pay the rent. Ah. Oh. What is wrong with that man? The one that is paining me most is that Vera is pregnant again. Mom, are you trying to tell me that Vera got pregnant again for him? Three months pregnant. Ah, she shouldn't have done a thing like that. And I wonder against it though. I wonder. I can't believe this. But Mom, you know this is not possible. How, how is it possible for my own sister to go back to her husband's? No, no, mom, that's not fair. I will to the not, village. I will not allow that. I'm going there tomorrow to bring her and her baby here. That's, that's a nice one. What's wrong with that man called Isog? Useless. <laughs> Thank you. Anything for you, baby girl. Mm -hmm. Take care of you, okay? You too. Okay. I will call you when I get home, all right? <laughs> Who is that guy that just dropped you off? Which guy? The guy that just left. Well, if you must know, he's my sister's friend. He offered to give me a ride. Anything wrong with that? Vera, you're a big liar. You are a big liar. Your sister's friend, you said? 
when I saw what conspired between you and that guy. What did you see? You gave him a peck on his cheek. I saw it. I saw it, Vera. It's your go. I will not take this. I will not take this from you, okay? Excuse me. Hey! You're just lying on the boy. What I just saw? It's where you're not with. Now, I believe it's more money. How much is the money? Now, can I digit or six numbers for me? How much is this money we are talking about? My name, who are you? Ikobi is asking who are you. It means that you can't can recognize me. <laughs> man, mm -hmm. look at you. Why are you looking like this? Mm -hmm. Now, can't get with you. Is one. Is a is a is a long story. Is a long story. My <laughs> God, man, look at you. Is a long story. Man, what happened to you? Man, you're not looking good, bro. Okay, we are. Is a long story. <laughs> you know what? Yeah. Just save it. Let's go to somewhere and discuss about this. Hmm? Look at you. One. <laughs> I'm so happy to see you. Hello. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you. Thank you, my angels. How are you doing? You're fine. Is it a lie? I'm not fine. You're not fine? What happened? Did cause a bit you? No, I tell you, not be tall. Mommy will feel so. Tell me where my daddy is. Will you tell me? <laughs> yes, yes, my princess. I will tell you, but first, let's go in. I bought something for the of you. Let's go. <laughs> Remind me when I said I've not eaten since yesterday. Just that the engineer will work for. I've not put anybody. Hmm? Well, it's okay. You know you are like a brother to me. You owe me no explanation. In fact, eat if this one is not okay, but that for more. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. so much she never hides us from us like mom does. Do you think she's going to tell us about her dad? She will. She will not. 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 She will not tell us. She will tell us. She will not. 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 What did you tell Auntie Cindy? Yes, I told her I want to know about my daddy. Don't say that to anybody in this house again. Is that clear? Yes, ma. Now go inside. Both okay. of you. I wonder what put such thoughts into her. Oh, mama. 
I now stay in one room apartment. I came to your place after everything. I was told that you've left the town. One week after that, I lost my phone and every contact in it. Which I came to your place. They told me you've backed out. What they told you is the truth. So that is it, my brother. You, you mean you're no longer with your wife? I have not set my eyes on my kid. Even the second one, I've not seen, I've not seen him or her. You don't know the sex of your baby. My wife's phone stopped going after she left the house. Have you tried to communicate with her? Hmm. Jacoby, let's not go into all that details. If I tell you what I'm passing through in the hands of my in-law, especially my mother-in-law, you'll be surprised. Good. Are you serious? Man, that's very bad. It's bad, Ojoka. My in-laws denied me the access of seeing my own children. When I am such a life, my brother, there is nothing that I see that to shed more than his holy tears. It's just be a man. Be a man. The most annoying part of this whole thing is that I have not set my eyes on my mother for seven years. Are you serious? Because of this, she warned me. She warned me so much about that family. I'm so ashamed of myself. Marrying a wife like my mate, is it a crime? It's not a crime, my brother. Careful. We did the right thing. It's quite unfortunate. It's quite unfortunate. Don't worry, I'll get this all in my All is not well. I had a terrible dream about your brother last night. The way I saw him, I didn't like it. We can't continue to keep quiet. It's been seven years he went missing. We've not heard or seen him. Mama, all is well with him. Have I not been to the city to see him, only to discover that he has moved out of his apartment? Don't talk like this, my daughter. I have this terrible feeling that all is not well. That something bad must have happened to him. Eh? Is that why his phone should not go? Mama, Brother Izoku does not want us to know about his new home. To avoid disturbance, just like you usually call it. Oh, have you forgotten the kind of wife he has? But why are you like this? We're not talking about one kind of stranger. It's about your brother. Your blood. In fact, you don't even have any other relation apart from him. Mama, why are you like this? It seems you don't even understand everything I'm trying to explain here. What are you explaining? <coughs> See, Please. that's your brother? Does not want us? Is that a reason his phone should be switched off? That his wife is a pest? Is that a reason for his phone to be switched off? That he doesn't want to help us or a reason for him to die? No! We're talking about your brother, your blood. Please be worried a little. Just, just, just say something reasonable. Say how you're going to help to go look for him. You're talking like this. Look at your face. You're just so indifferent. This is not fair. So this is not Mama, fair. Please. I have lots of work to do at the shop today. Please. I'll see you when I come back. Why are you talking like this? 
And I'll see you when I come back. Hey! Hey! Let me just see this one. Okay, And who is that? I beg, make you come carry your eyes here. I should go and see who the person is. Yes, now. I could not say I don't commit another crime again. Ah, okay. How are you? Please, what do you want? Uh, it's my madam. She is not here. Okay, you take a I just told you that my sister is not in. Okay. Uh, okay. Can I please see my kids? At least. No. Wait here. Please lock this door. Wait, wait. Oh God, they don't tell you something. You wait, Cindy. Guess who is here? Who? Izuogo. Izuogo? Izuogo. What is he doing here? He said he came to see his wife. Which wife? Where is he? He's outside the gates. I told him that sister is not in. Good. Where are the children? They are upstairs. Mwah. Go upstairs and stay with them. Don't let them come downstairs. All right, mom. What? Okay. What kind of nonsense is this? What is he doing here? I have told him to leave my daughter alone, that he is not welcome here on Abia. Eh? Okay. Friend is taking time. Um, yes, he will soon be here. Hmm? After that, I'll make up for the next time. <laughs> Just as I said, we should, we should be here in a minute. Alright. Alright. Mabu. <laughs> You're sexy. Oh, I'm not sweet at Vera. Vera. Yes. Why are you pestering my life? And so, and so, leave me alone. Maybe let's leave here. Let's go. Let's go. Vera, young man, you heard the lady. Hmm? Leave her alone. Vera, Vera, it's me. Vera.
Sarah has left me for another man. She's the reason I'm in this condition. I've not been to the village for the past seven years. All because I'm ashamed to face them. Me. A homie is your. A homie is your. A barrel pusher. Selfishness, selfishness, heartless. That's what she gives. No happiness, only sadness and fallenness. Every day, wickedness, selfishness, and happiness. It's what she gives. No happiness, only bitterness, unfollowness. Every day, heaven knows I try to make it work. But it seems she never cared for me. Happiness is now a history. Tears and sorrow is what she gives to me. Heaven knows I try to make it work. But it seems she never cared for me. Happiness is now a history. Tears and sorrow is what she gives to me. Wickedness, selfishness, heartless. That's what she gives. No happiness, only sadness and fallenness. Every day, wickedness, selfishness, and happiness. It's what she gives. No happiness, only bitterness, and fallenness. Every day. Yeah, what I, I saw this thing, so I want to uh, indicate my interest. I'm interested. She said you can feed this can work. Yeah, now what's in there then? Now this is your cap. She said you can feed one. This is my cap. I feed one. Uh, wait, I'll come. My turn, madam. Okay. Uh, just sit down. I'll come. It's okay. Hold up, hold up. Madam, sorry. Yeah. We get one tall man. Here we are on the car. Pay for our side. He said, come for the notice. We did for our side. Okay, let him in. So, Jane, you need. I made a lot of money, girl. <laughs> I'm seriously. Girl, my house is so big with flowers and everything. <laughs> girl, I'm not not change. Not like I said before. You know what I mean? <laughs> I swear down, girl. <laughs> Madam. Madam, I'm going to ask you. Okay. Um, Jane, I'll, I'll have to talk to you later. Look, we have to do dinner, all right? Dinner on me. Yes! I'll call you. Don't worry. I have a visitor. Yeah. Okay. I'll talk to you later. All right. Okay, girl. <laughs> you can go. Okay. All right. Yeah. Hi. Why are you looking at me like that? Hey. Lucy! Do you know my name? Lucy, is this you? How did you know me? Lucy! Can't you recognize this face? <gasps> it's so good! To you, well, what about your wife? Um, Lucy, can I talk? Can I tell you exactly what brought me here? Okay, well, what brought you here? Okay, it's about the vacancy I saw at the wall on your gate. <laughs> I'm sorry, <laughs> that 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 can be possible. You can't be my gardener. Stop it. What brought you here? What really brought you here? 
a vacancy. Is it that bad? It's okay. Um, <clears throat> okay, come, come in. Let's talk. Smoke. Gardner. Please come. In. I'm here because of this notice. This notice? Yes. Bros, I feel like this now. Person don't already come where they inside with madam. Welcome for this notice. Yeah? I need the star work already. Yeah. Hey, please. I need this job. I'm jobless. Please. Yeah, okay, I know say you did jobless and you need the job. Yeah, but if I can't say you know there again. Yeah, if you walk down the next house, eh? No gas solo house, go there. The only person where they pump water or where they own gen. You dig me? If you go there, apply, they go accept you, yeah? Please, please. I don't have a work. I'm a jobless man. Okay. I don't have a work. I don't have anything I'm doing for now. Please. Can you help me? Uh, okay, I, I said really need this job. Okay. Okay, I said look I like this now. Uh, I said look like this now. You know deaf. You they talk well, you they hear me sound and clear. Work, you know day for here again. Go down after the three building, Naga Solo own. Go there, go apply. Walk, no day for here again. And you didn't hear me, so, baby. I understand, no but please, please. I don't uh, have anything I'm doing. No I'm stand, they tell me, please. please, please. Rotate please, like please. this. Please. Uh, rotate. Please. They go, walk, no day. Please, please. Uh, tell me, please, please. Back at no day. Let's do the Naga Solo house. Please help me. Tell me, please, please stand. Please, 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 please. As this is just here, and I don't know if it's plenty problem, but plenty people don't come. Person go come, they be like deaf and dumb. Please, 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 please. I don't come watch you like this. Please, 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 please. How can you tell me? Please, please. This is Lucy's house. Eh? Wonder never end. She says she has been abroad for like three years. to clean yourself up, get new clothes, go to the salon, clean up your beards, basically just look good. I promise I will restore your glory. I'll make you a man again. I promise. Lucy, thank you so much. May God bless you. Lucy, thank you. Amen. <laughs> Listen, um, 
You see... Despite your hardship, look, I want to ravish you. I want to take care of you. Just, just give me a chance, okay? Let's, let's, let's not talk about this. I am not talking about it. I, you know how much, you know how much I cherish you. You know how much I've always wanted you, even. Even when you were not married, like... Uh, uh, let me see, let me see, let me see, let me stop this. Stop this. Stop it. What is your problem? Look, I've longed for a day like this. It is... Stop it. What is your problem? You are a married man. <laughs> what has that gotten you into? Look at you, your wife has useless you. She has eaten all your money and left you useless. Left you, left you to, to nothing. Ridiculed you as a man. You still, you still talking about your wife. Your wife, your wife, your wife. What has she done to you? What is your problem? I mean, take a good look at me. Am I not sexy enough? Am I not rubbishing enough? Just, just, just stop it, okay? No matter what Vera must have done, I, I still love her. My wife, I still love her. All I want from you is your help. I want you to help me. Please. You still love her. And you want me to help you. See. No, I just I just want to know. Look at you. Just take a good look at yourself. Your wife has useless to you. You are nothing. You, you're just like a you're a fool at 40. And a fool at 40 is a fool forever. Oh yes! I am here giving myself to you, giving my sexy self to you. What, what do I get? Rejection, isn't it? Now, keep my money and get out of my house. Keep my money and get out of my house. I don't want to repeat myself. Don't make me repeat myself. Just in case you change your mind. You know where to find me. Okay, I will tell you. Um, his name is Isuoku. It's tall, like Cindy. Cindy, what is the meaning of this? What are you telling my children? Mom, she was telling us about our daddy. You shut your mouth. Vera, why are you shouting? Yes, why are you shouting? What have I done? You are very stupid and senseless to ask me that huh? stupid question. Huh? What were you telling them? Why are you so wicked, Cindy? I thought you were sensible. Oh, no, 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 Vera! I won't take that! Please, that is an insult! I won't take it! Else what? What will you do? What will you do? Don't insult me again. Ah! 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 What will you do? Vera, did you just slap me? You want to hit me back? Ah! You want to hit me back? Try it! Vera, if not that, you are my elder sister! I will slap you, you back! Okay, go on! Try it! Try it! Don't try this again! Don't you ever Don't try it again! Don't me! I'm going to break your heart! Try just it. leave me alone! Leave me alone! Try leave it. me alone! Just try it next time! I'm going to break your head! Try it! Look, 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 look at this idiot! They're coming to challenge me, idiot! Rubbish! Both of you go inside! Go, 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 go back! Take this glasses! Take it inside! Can you imagine? Rubbish. Mom! Mom! 
warned Cindy. Warn her. What has she done? Mother, this is not the first nor the second time she's doing this. I want her to stop telling my children about his own, but she wouldn't listen. She's stepping on my toes, Mom. Warn her. What is it? Eh? What is it, Seth? Huh? What is it? Will you shut up? Mom, you needed to say the way she embarrassed me in front of her children. Eh? What did I even tell them? Talk to her, Mom. Talk to her. Tell Mom what I told your children. You see the way she shouted? She's actually shouting at me. Vera, I don't know what I've done to you in this household. I don't know. Can you, can you two just keep quiet? Keep quiet, let me understand what is going on here. Mom, ask Vera here why she keeps attacking me each time she sees me with her children. Am I the reason you left your husband's house? What? Did you stop, stop, stop! Come on, stop. Eh? touch me! Vera! Vera, come and touch me! Vera, sit. Try it! Sit. Come on, touch me! Sit. I don't want to hear anything from you again. Is that clear? Yes, ma'am. Brother, what happened to him? No, I don't think he's the one. I need to be sure before I see what I need to be sure. After the whole toiling of the day. After giddy 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 giddy. After gather 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 gather. Gather gather go go do go do giddy giddy gather gather. This is what I got. Not even up to two thousand. Not even up to two thousand naira. For how long will I continue like this? For how long? I've not even eaten. Maybe I'm trying to save money. Not even, not even uh, 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 an orange entered my mouth today because I'm trying to save money. Yeah? When I continue like this, what, what, is, what, is, what, is, what is this? Lucy, 
Thank you so much. May God bless you. Lucy, thank you. Amen. <laughs> Listen, um, you see, Despite your hardship, look, I want to ravish you. I want to take care of you. Just, just give me a chance, okay? Let's, let's, let's not talk about this. I am not talking about it. I, you know how much, you know how much I cherish you. You know how much I've always wanted you, even. Even when you were not married, like... Uh, 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 stop this. Stop this. Stop it. What is your problem? Look, I've longed for a day like this. It is... Stop it. 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 Stop Look at you, your wife has useless you. She has eaten all your money and left you useless. Left you, left you to, to nothing. Ridiculed you as a man. You still, you still talking about your wife. Your wife, your wife, your wife. What has she done to you? What is your problem? I mean, take a good look at me. Am I not sexy enough? Am I not rubbish enough? Just, 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 just stop it, okay? No matter what very much I've done, I still love her. My wife, I still love her. All I want from you is your help. I want you to help me. Please. You still love her. And you want me to help you. See. No, I just I just want to know. Look at you. Just take a good look at yourself. Your wife has useless to you. You are nothing. You, you're just like a you're a fool at 40. And a fool at 40 is a fool forever. Oh yes! I am here giving myself to you, giving my sexy self to you. What, what do I get? Rejection, isn't it? Now, keep my money and get out of my house. Keep my money and get out of my house. I don't want to repeat myself. Don't make me repeat myself. Just in case you change your mind. You know where to find me. I really need help. I can't continue like this. I need help.
mamu. Ai. 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 So sorry, I didn't want my mother to hear of this. Oh, are you sure it was my brother you saw? It was him. I couldn't believe it myself until I followed him to where he dropped the load. Did he see you? No, I didn't want him to see me. Hero. So Vera has finally rendered my brother useless. Hey, baby. You need to trace him to find out what went wrong. I could take you to the way by your stand. Because please promise me you won't say this to anybody. I don't want my mother to hear of it. She will break down. You're the please. only one I've told about it. Mm. Okay, so can we go there tomorrow? Um, I'll make a chance. Okay, no problem. I'll call you later this evening. No problem. Just tell Mama I've gone. All right. Thank you very All much. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Did anything happen? No, Mama. Where is Ngozi? She just left. Already? Yes, Mama. But I heard her talking about somebody. Who was that? Oh, <laughs> it was her brother, Mama. He's in trouble. How are you? I'm fine. Who are you? I'm your daddy. Yeah, my dad. Yeah. Mommy! 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 Ella, what is it? What is it? Both of you go inside. Mom, is he your daddy? Both of you go inside. Yes. What are you doing here? Why didn't you tell my children who I am? You have not answered my question. What are you doing here? Vera, why are you treating me like this? I am still your husband. And those kids are mine. Well said. Now leave before my mother sees you. I will not leave. I'm going nowhere. Till you tell them who I am. Fine. I will tell them that you are their father. Can you go now? No. Uh, what? Yeah. 
Vera, who brought this up again? Huh? I am here to see my children. Which children? The ones you have been taking care of, or which ones? You have seen them, right? You can go. Leave! I am not going anywhere. How did this man even enter here? I don't know, Mom. And he has refused to leave. Till I see my children. Then what? Going nowhere. Call your father and tell him what is going on. Alright. Bring them down, I want to see them. He's our dad. He's our dad. He's not. He's our dad. He's not. He's our dad. He's yes. Not. What's Mom, the argument he... about? Mom, is it our dad? Tell us. Okay. I will tell you later. Go to your room now. Okay. You need to see my in-laws' reaction when he saw me. You mean you remained there until their father came back? Hmm. I said to myself that enough is enough. Now tell me, what was the man's reaction when he saw you? Did he kick you out? It wasn't easy. My wife and the mother wanted me out. But the man was like, they should allow me, they should let me be. And I asked them to leave us. That he wants to have a word with me. Just like that? Yes, just like that. But do you know what? What? My wife's mother protested against it. But the man still told the wife to let me be. And asked me to always come around to see my children whenever I want. I couldn't just believe it. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Oh, life. Mm. How? Do you know that Day was that man that never wanted to see me around his household? Yes. I know about that. That's why I'm surprised you. I'm surprised that the man is telling you all this. Anyway, my joy now is that my children now know their father. You understand? I can be able to see my children. So I'm happy. <laughs> I'm happy once again. I'm very happy for you. <laughs> but you haven't said one thing. What's that? But then with the pass, what was your wife's reaction when all this was happening? Uh, when she saw you, what did she do? Vera, Vera wasn't happy. Well, she wasn't happy at all, but I know with time, she get to vary it. Okay, okay. I'm happy once again. I'm happy once again. I'm happy once again. I'm happy once again. I'm so happy for you. I'm happy for you. I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy for you. Actually, pushing a rebarrow. Tell me the for yourself. I wish they know where it stays. I can't believe this. Yeah. How will my mother feel if she hears of it? You need to keep it away from her for now. At least we might be lucky. Let's just walk down that road. Okay? Put yourself together. Get your dirty buttocks off my seat. Are you mad? Listen, next time you come here, if you must sit, sit on the floor. 
I'm sorry, man. A hold me. A hold me, Mumwa. Hey! Go see. Hey, hey, hey! Hey! There's no time for that. Go out. Wait for me outside. I'll join you. Go outside and wait for me. Bye. Bye, Dad. Why must you do a thing like that? Why? What are you still doing here? Can't you see we are going out? I'll wait for you here till you come back. Now, boy. Devin. My friend, leave my father's compound. Leave my father's house. I'm not going anywhere. I'll wait for you here. It's all is all good. I will push you. I will push you. Leave my father's house. Please, I want to watch my wife. Good for nothing, man. Daddy, are you not coming with us? Hmm? Daddy, now come with us. I will come with you, but not today. Daddy, why are you not staying with us? I will come back tomorrow, okay? Now buy biscuits for both of you. Buy burger. Burger. Bur Daddy will buy. Come, come. come here. Why are you still here? Leave now. Won't you allow me to talk with my kids? Mommy, why are you shouting at Daddy? Allow me to talk to my children. I will buy you burger. I said you should go. What are you? Is this your house? Just. Hey, baby. Yes, we are ready. Oh, you're at the gate. Outside the gate. Okay. You will see us now. All right. Kisses. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. You're looking hot as always. As always. Just not that. <laughs> okay. So inside. Um, you know what? I just got this new belly. I can see. And I want you to be the first person to give us a ride in it. Hmm? It's our pleasure. Kisses, baby. Mwah. I'm gonna drive us. Drive me crazy, baby. Yeah. <laughs> This is not the same man that always come to look for my wife. Now he's here to take her out. Wickedness, selfishness, heartless. That's what she gives. 
no happiness, only sadness, I'm falling next. Every day, wickedness, selfishness, and happiness is what she gives. No happiness, only bitterness. If my children had known how many miles I trek to come here, they would pity me. They would just pity me. Is everything I'm okay, I'm okay. Everything's alright. Everything is alright. Everything think, is alright. Yes, I think <coughs> I overworked myself in this <coughs> farm today. <coughs> Sorry. Oh, I've overworked myself in the farm today. <coughs> uh, my son. You see why I say you shouldn't go to that farm? Eh? Because of your health challenges. I'm okay. And you insist that look at it that you're coughing again. You, 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 you think you can walk in a farm in this your condition? But no, I have my son here. That's huh? right. Yes. Oh, I am very proud of you, son. You made me very proud. Hmm? That shows you are hard working. I'm very proud of you. Huh? Nice to say. Like father, like son. You, you can't say that again. I'm <coughs> sorry. You see why I said you shouldn't go because of your health issue. I'm okay. Now, you must keep up your good behavior. Hmm? And uh, promise me that. <coughs> promise me that you will not abandon your mother huh? and your brother or sister huh? i promise that when i am gone gone to where mm. where did where are you uh, where are you uh, planning to go i'm uh, not going anywhere not going anywhere but this <laughs> promise and confidence <laughs> and <laughs> are you people doing wedding or what bring me water why are you talking like that <laughs> what is it is that go hurry now <laughs> hurry with the water my son has abandoned me at last all this wouldn't have happened if my husband were to be alive Sock. Who did it? 
Who's Ella? It's Kusi. Kusi, you see her alive, right? She's lying. How many times have I warned you to stop playing in that kitchen? Have you ever seen your mom sweep that kitchen for once? Eh? You have not, right? So, why did you mess it up? I'm asking you, why did you mess it up? Come here, come here. Why did you mess that kitchen up? Why? Eh? I'm talking to you, Cindy. Why did you beat my children? Go to the kitchen and see how they messed the whole place up. And so, is that enough reason for you to beat them? Don't you know they are kids? Kids, my fault. How dare you? Did you just slap me? Yes, I did. Hey. I did. And if you lay your useless hands on my kids again, I will skin you alive. Then teach them good manners. What is going on? What is it? What is it? She's overstepping her bounds in this house. She beats my children at every slightest thing they do. And that is because you have failed to teach them good manners. Don't touch me! Don't touch me! Don't touch me! Don't touch me. Mom, allow me! Allow me! Allow me, Mom! Allow me! Allow you beat up your younger sister? Warn her. Warn her! I will not take it again from her. Rubbish. Did you really beat our children? Mom, those kids are becoming nuisance in this house. They keep messing everywhere up. Take it easy with them. They are mad children. You were once like them, messing everywhere up. I don't want this problem in this house again. Okay, Mom. Mom, Vera slapped me. Go and clean up their mess in the kitchen. <gasps> okay, Mom. To the hospital. Eh? Ah, the fever is getting too much on you. No, just, just, just call Azodo for me. Call Azodo for me. Call Azodo. Okay. I cannot walk. I cannot walk. I cannot walk. Oh, aye. Eh, what? Hi. Call Azodo to the hospital first. You need medical attention. Just call Azodo for me. Azim, come and help me. I cannot walk. Okay. I cannot walk. I cannot walk. Oh, sorry. Oh. Okay, Mama. Uh, you have to wait for me. Oh, what? Can you go look for a bike? Please. Please wait for me. Eh? What I'm trying to tell you is stop going there and reducing yourself to nothing. Eh? Stop reducing yourself by going there every day. I am going there because of my children. I drive joy in seeing them. I know they are your children. Nobody's dragging it with you. They are your eh? children. When the time comes, they will run back to you. Ikobi, these children, for now, they are a source of my happiness. Okay? Whenever I set my eyes on them, it gives me joy. Well, I know about that. After all said and done. My main concern now is your mother. You need to travel to the village to see that woman. Wait. You mean I should travel to the village in this my condition? Eh? Ah, I thought you meant well for me. I thought you are my friend. It's all good. There is nothing wrong with what I just told you now. Well, if you Johnny Yemko. This woman is your mother. You've not seen her or spoken with her for seven good years. I know. You need to go and see her. I know. My mother is alright. She's fine. 
Are you sure? How did you know? I'm not here to argue with you. Oh, huh? When I was in past, you're not angry because I told you the truth, oh, eh? Wait, wait. Ikobi, tell me. Tell me, what have you ever done for me since I'm in this condition as your friend? Mm -hmm. Apart from taking me to the bar, then him some money. Now, I'm some money. Eh? This is what I've done you. for me. I'm your friend. 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 All I've done so far is to advise you so things will get better. Panicking. Oh, it's my mother. Oh, she's in the hospital. Oh, she's seriously sick. Is that why you are crying? Don't worry, she will be alright. Huh? She oh, said I should call you. The way she is sounding, Uncle, I don't think she will make it. Ah, don't say that. She will make it. She will be alright. Huh? Meanwhile, let me go in and dress. So that will go. Huh? Okay. Uncle. Stop panicking. Huh? I wish for you here. Yeah, yeah. Uncle, please be fast. Oh. <laughs> Mommy, why didn't Dad come to visit us today? He will come tomorrow. Mommy. Is it that you are calling on the phone? No. Mom, please, can I have your phone? I want to call daddy to ask him why he didn't come to visit us. Go see! Please. Go to your room. Now. Okay, mom. Ogam Namde, because you're a young guy like me. Yeah, you know, we, we, all of us, we just treat the hustle. You know as they be now, eh? Help me talk to your father to come down for some time. I will run around for the money and bring it for him. My father said I should let you know. Eh? You have to pack out from this house today. As I'm talking to you now, eh? the new tenant is there. He's packing in any moment from but, now. Well, don't collect money for, for the new tenant. Already. It's not fair now, man. Talk, talk to your father for me now. I'm just passing a message. Hey, so. not, no, no, no. It's no, not sir, right. I didn't warn you. They warned. Nandi, you're, you're a guy like me. Nandi, talk to your father for me now. You yourself, you go stay for person house tomorrow. You don't claim money. Hey! Mama! 
the gate locked outside. My name is Emeka and I live around here. Please, I will advise you to leave this place immediately before you implicate yourself. This house was hidden by the police. Why? Say the owner of the house was arrested yesterday for kidnapping offense. He's a kidnapping man. Kidnap what? Say, but did you know who you're talking about? Madam, I will advise you to leave this place. Because if, if you are caught here, you'll be the serious problem. Just leave for your own good. But, but, wait, wait, wait. Kidnap campaign. Pascal is you. It's me. Hey! Hey! Flesh and, flesh and blood. <laughs> hey! Okay, 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 okay. My man! <laughs> no. Pascal! Are, are you doing what I'm saying? Flesh and blood. What are you doing here? Pascal. Life, life. Okay, what kind of game? Now I'm happy no, no, to no, see no. you. Get in, get in, get in, get in. <laughs> This is a dream, so I can wake up from it. I've been dealing with a deadly kidnapper. God, please forgive me. Please forgive me. Lara. Are you alright? I'm fine. Mom. What is wrong with Vera? She said she was fine. But I know that she's hiding something. She doesn't look happy at all. I know. She's hiding something from me. Mom, please, go and talk to her, okay? Before she will look for who to transfer her aggression to. Pascal, wait, 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 wait. So this is Relax, you need to relax. Ah, I relax, don't it's all it's all 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 it's 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 Wait, 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 wait. Tell me the truth. Is this your house? 
That's guy. That's guy. That's guy. Money is good. Money is good. Don't worry, don't That is the loss to eat. Okay. Understand. Okay. But first of all, we need to clean it up. Alright. Let's wait for me. I'm all going to go. I'm 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 The only brand I have is nowhere to be found. What kind of life is this good? I know how you feel. I feel the same pain too. But, but there is nothing we can do about this. Huh? Stop crying. You know? Go out of my water, leave me. She was the only one I have in my life. I know. I know, but there is nothing we can do to realize this. Do not cry. Don't cry. My mother wouldn't have died if she had listened to me and stopped worrying herself about my brother. Mama! What has happened has happened. Stop crying. Stop crying. Stop crying. Stop crying. I had to stop my brother. It's so touching indeed. So sorry for what happened to you. Pascal has been passing through hell. I lost my dignity as a man. One minute. I can't even go to the village to see my mother because I'm ashamed of myself. <sighs> this is what I've always told people. The downfall of a man is not the beginning of his life. I know you must have learned a lot about what happened to you at the past. Stop. Please, well. Pascal, my case is beyond that. It's alright. I'm happy we met. Like, everything worked like a like god plan. Like, I'm happy I come into your life to rescue you at this point in time. I was, I was supposed to travel a day before yesterday. But my ticket was cancelled. You don't mean it. Of course. Listen, I have to cancel my ticket just to set for your mother. Pascal, wait. If you're if you're saying this to ask Vera to come back, Pascal, she's not going to listen to you. I'm not talking about Vera. Okay. Okay. I'm talking about opening opening a business for you. Listen, I cannot forget in the hurry what you did for me when I was about traveling to Malaysia. I was financially down. Came to my rescue. Oh. Pascal, that was in the past. Uh, you were talking about 15 years ago. That was in the past. And I'm getting it. was not all quite only for the other little man. I know. So I can never forget what he did for me. Like, it's unforgettable. I know. What's that with thank God? Most importantly, we are alive today. I thank God that we met. I understand that. This is the check of form that I have. I don't know if it's gonna be enough, but I might be going a long way. Use it for our business. Pascal. It's not that. Four million naira for me? Yes, not that. Oh, God. Oh, Pascal. 
ますか。おお、そうけ、考え、レステン。よいしょ。よいしょ。やんでて、フレン。I, I want to tell you this thing. I bought this house the last time I came back from Malaysia. I wanted to feel at home. Okay? It's your house for now. I would want you to stay. Can you come now? It's okay. Come down. I wanted to run your business from here for now. Feel comfortable. Feel at home. It's okay. It's okay. Daddy, will you carry us in your car? Yeah, Daddy, please carry us. Of course, I will. You're my kid. You're my chicken. You're my angel. And you're my guy. So I'll carry you guys, okay? Yeah. <laughs> my boy. That's my girl. So I listen to you guys to enjoy it. Mm -hmm. And uh Mommy, I'll show up for daddy. Hi. Hi. Daddy. Mom is not happy because she has not been visiting us for a long time now. Yes, it's just because Daddy have been busy all this while. Hmm? Okay, so are you going to apologize to Mom? Of course, I will. Yeah, you're a good man. Yes, he's a good man. Yeah, I know. Um, as you can see, I bought all this for you so you can eat, get strong and get fat. Whoa. Do you understand? Okay. Yeah. Oh. These are for the kids. Okay? And here is our hundred thousand now. Have it. Go on. You can use it for their upkeep. And this is my card too. I have my address there and then um, whatever you need to know about me, it's there. Just make, give me a call and then um, you can come visiting with the kids. Anytime you wish. Okay? Okay. I know I'm wrong. Many times I cannot even count it again. Count it again. Are you saying that Izuago brought this money and the provision I saw inside? Yes, mom. How? How come? Where did he get the money from? Here is his business card. How come on? come back to business. How come? I don't know. Your children even told me that he came in a new car. Yes. Behind the car there is his residential address. He said I can bring the kids anytime I want. And he didn't tell you any other thing? I was so dumbfounded to ask him questions. This is so unbelievable. It's so Mama? Mama? Ebere? 
Hey, Bere! Ah, where are they? Are they, are they all sleeping? Mama, oh! Hey. Mama! Bye. Hey, bye. Hey, bye. Where is Mama? And what are you doing here? Hey, why are you crying? So you are still alive. I'm alive. Then what can I get to get for? You are a wicked man. Where is Mama? Where I know I've wronged you many times I cannot Stop! Oh, I will play Liverpool Man City. 2.5, no. 3-1 correct score. 3-1 correct score. Any number. Any... Hey, Mama, can Good afternoon, Good afternoon. I'm looking for Mr. Izogo. Ha! Mr. Izogo? You just say you know the Miss Road. I know the Miss Road. He's my husband. You're waiting? Your husband? I'm not waiting. I'm not going to call him. I'm going to call him. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. I know I've failed you. I don't even know how to stop to apologize. Apologize. Oh. I'm so sorry for all the things I have done, and I wish to make it up to you. I'm so sorry for all the things I have done and I wish to make you I wish I saw the future I will not give up on you I was so selfish to see how much you love me I know I brought What happened to her? Mom, where is she? What have you come here to do? Vera, leave my brother alone! 
He can no longer marry a wicked and heartless woman like you. Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse you what? Vera, I will never ever in my life forgive you. Because you have a hand in the high blood pressure that claimed my mother's life. Never! She's dead. It is over between you and my brother. Yes. And as for the kids, he will come get them when he's ready for it. Now leave. It's okay. Vera! Can't you get it? He can no longer talk to you. Now leave here. Else I will push you out. Why are you chasing my mother away? Well, please tell the kids to the living room upstairs, okay? Please I go. know I've wronged you many times. I cannot even count it again. Count it again. I know I've wronged you. I don't even know how to start to apologize. Apologize now. I'm so sorry for all the things that I My husband. My love. I'm sorry for all I have done. Please. Find a place in your heart to forgive me. I have realized all my mistakes. Please. Vera, just stand up and leave. I have nothing to tell you. Oh God. But I just want to know that you have forgiven me. Please. Please. What you and your family made me pass through is beyond forgiveness. I lost my mother because of what she made me went through. I'm sorry. Vera, could you have been doing this if I were in my former position? Because you see things are getting better. My love, my mother misled me. Please, but all that is in the past now. I'm sorry, I'm a changed person, please. Vera, it's too late. You can get up and leave. My children will stay back. Please, I'm sorry. Please. Vera, see what you've done to yourself. I loved you and your family. Just look at you. Please. I'm, I'll make up for everything. Please, I'm sorry. Please. Please, I beg you. I, beg you. I lost my mother because of what you and your family made me went through. I, all I could get from you was heartbreak. You left me for another man because of his money. So where is he now? Where is he? Nowhere to be found. Or you think I didn't hear of his harvest? You think I didn't know? Please leave. No. Baby. Please, I'm sorry. I love you so much. Don't do this to me, please. I know I've failed you. I don't even know how to start to apologize. My husband, she has been like this since she came back. I've asked her what the problem is, but she refused to talk to me. She did not even come back with the children. Vera, what's the matter? Where are the kids? 
Talk now. Mother, let me be. Leave me alone. I'm suffering today because of you. You broke my marriage with your evil advice. Vera! I've lost everything because of you. You're an evil mother. God will judge you. To err is human, but to forgive is divine. So please, find a place in your heart. Forgive her daughter and take her back as your wife, please. Is it Borgo? Honestly, uh, I don't know where to start from. I'm truly ashamed of myself. My husband has said it all. Please forgive us. Forgive our daughter and take her back. Please. Uncle, please, we're begging you. Be calm, please. Okay. You people are asking me for forgiveness. To forgive you and your daughter. <sighs> okay, that's nice. Good one. What about my dead mother? Are you people going to bring her back to life? No, answer me. to be your wife again. But please, find a place in your heart to forgive me. I promise to make up for all the years. Please. Please. Uh, okay. Pico Bala. Ndi go to Kwani no sina. Bido tata de kama. Bido go. Oh, why? Darling, are you not done with them? Yeah, I'm done with them. I'm done with them. Um, where are my kids? Yeah, I think that's your stuff. Let's go. Um, Vera, as you can see, somebody that is worth being a wife has taken your position. And uh, the children love her. And she's happy with them too. She's really taking care of them. Yes. Um, Chief, with all due respect, sir, this uh, meeting is over. I'm done. You people can leave now. Let's go. Let's go. I know I've wronged you many times. I cannot even count it again. Count it again. I know I've failed. Please. I'm a changed person. Please don't do this to me. Please. It's okay, I've forgiven you. It's okay. But you can go now. It's okay. Take care of yourself. I know I've failed you. I don't even know how to start to apologize. Apologize. I'm so sorry for all the things I have done. And I wish to make it up to you I'm so sorry for all the things I have done And 
And I wish to make it up to you I wish I saw the future I will not give up on you I was so selfish to see how much you love me I know I've wronged you Many times I cannot even count it again Count it again I know I've failed you I don't even know how to start to apologize I'm so sorry for all the things I have done And I wish to make it up to you I'm so sorry for all the things I have done And I wish to make it up to you I wish I saw the I will not give up on you I was so selfish to see how much you love